This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com. Parental discretion is advised. This show is brought to you by Slice on Broadway. Supporting Pittsburgh podcasting with the perfect pepperoni pizza, sliceonbroadway.com. IndieWrestling.us. Check out IWC, RWA, and more. And listeners like you, support this show at patreon.com slash wrestling mayhem show. Just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait. Wait for the perfect time and attack. Don't give a what you want, take it back. Wait for the perfect time and It is the Wrestling Mayhem Show, episode 659. I'm Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter here in the Sorgatron Media Studios in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And we got a lot going on tonight. First of all, we have, uh, let me see if I got my buttons right. Oh, out there in Beacon, New York, it is Mad Mike. Guys, I just beat Oscar for the SmackDown Women's Oh, show. good. That's good to see. Good, good for you. Good for you. Mm-hmm. Everybody gets around. Mm, bacon. <laughs> Pass it around. What? Bacon. Bacon, New York. Also with us. Oh, no, there. Yeah. Uh, producer Missy's hanging out on the couch. Hi, guys. Hey, because why not tonight? Cause... You know, you know what this means. What? I am not doing show notes. Oh no. Oh no. That means it's going to be a long night for me. Uh. Anyways. Ser- also, let's 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 take a live look at the main ha- mayhem mania board. Mainstream Matt is. What? Look at that notebook. <laughs> Um, is is preparing the board. We have matches um, going on on cards, so we can do some work around them here. I love the little heart signs with the uh, couples match that you have going on there. So Mainstream Matt is uh, currently in process. I'm sure he'll he'll sit down and and drop some opinions here as we go through the show uh, here. But we'll get it going because we know we, we know we have a lot of you guys waiting in the wings live here on the stream. Uh, for this, and let uh, me say, well, if, you, if you're there live, we're probably going to call you in around 10 o'clock p.m. And Eastern Time. And uh, but in the meantime, let's try to talk about some professional wrestling to kick off the show. But this is the Wrestling Mayhem Show. You can check out everything at WrestlingMayhemShow.com, where you can find links to subscribe to us in podcast and video form, or look us up on your favorite platform. You can email us at that email address. Good time. Good times at WrestlingMayhemShow.com or 412206WMS0. Tweet us at Mayhem Show and look up the Wrestling Mayhem Show Facebook page and group. The group, uh, Wrestling Mayhem Show Facebook group, is where a lot of great discussion is happening, or we share some rather goofy things as well. Also, um, hit up the uh, uh, we're, we're on the, the Facebook page every Tuesday at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Even if we're not entirely prepared, I will be on to just chat with you in the, ch- the chat room. Uh, until we we are we are ready, and uh, of course we are also streaming on um, we are also streaming on some other platforms as well. Okay, I put the show notes together, sir. You can still read them. I'm working on it. <laughs> I'm working on it. It's a process. 10 p.m. Eastern time. 10 p.m. Eastern time for anybody out there that it's live. We're going to be calling you up uh, for Patreon on the bank. It's Patreon on the bank night. Hate hence the board. Hence the craziness. Hence, everybody in the chat room and all of our great supporters at patreon.com slash wrestling mayhem show. Our friends at the fan of the show on dollar level, Bo Diggity! Woo! 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 Ed Burke, Bobby F. Town, Tina Keys, and the Matthew and Jennifer Carlin's Foundation for Podcast Betterment. At the Pocket Club, $5 level, getting some extra video content, which is setting up the board tonight, actually, is uh, our friends uh, at the Occupy Pro Wrestling, Bradley Brothers, Doc Remedy, Dave Potter of the Tiny Shutter Podcast, Kyle Turner, and Daniel Towery. And at the Peace Club, $10 level, doing the graphics the entire Mayhem Mania season, our friends at TheWrestlingRevolution.com. And at the Manager $20 level is Mad Mike. That's you. That is you. Oh, you can me. sub... I, I, Sorg, this is my WrestleMania. This is your WrestleMania. <laughs> Despite WrestleMania being in your backyard. Um, <laughs> Kyle... Hey, 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 hey. New Jersey is not my backyard. Ooh, yes. It's well, more like downhill. You are the one with the future endeavored letters, so technically wouldn't it be your ex-WrestleMania? Wait. I'm confused. Is Anyways, it my, is it my is it my destination X then? Apparently, uh, uh, by the way, we need to update this. And and um, uh, Mainstream Matt, I don't know if you have this. 
Uh, Occupy Wrestling is actually at the uh, at the manager level this month. Yes. You are aware. Okay. Correction in there. He won't shut up about it. it. (laughs) Anyways. Wait, who are we talking about? I think I missed that. You can support the show at patreon.com slash wrestling mayhem show. You can. New New Jersey being the basement, not the backyard. Uh, (laughs) uh, Kyle Turner is saying it, and we'll get the Patreon in the bank in the second half of the show. This is going to be bigger, a bigger amount of insanity than a SmackDown title change. (laughs) Of which we had one tonight. Um, man, we are just pooping on Asuka as a champion here tonight, aren't we? Wait. What? Mike, are you okay? Is Bobby okay? Have we checked on Bobby of J-Town? He's not okay out there. So, no. Like, no one should be okay here. So okay, I, I I did the like things you should know. Again, I'm catching up because I didn't get to watch a lot of wrestling this week, a lot of the WWE wrestling this week. So I, I went to YouTube and I watched the like. There's just people carrying chairs and furniture up the street. Uh, anyways, um, sorry, distract. There's a lot going on here. Um, you know, I watched the five things you should know, and I saw there's a four way to see who's going to face Oscar for the title at, at WrestleMania. But apparently it doesn't matter anymore because Charlotte beat her for the Women's Championship tonight uh, on SmackDown. Um, did you see it, Mad Mike? No, you I did not. No, you did I not. was in transit. I just, like, I got I got home. I changed. I got ready for the show. I pulled up Twitter. I'm like, eh, let's see if I missed anything. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so I guess mm-hmm. have they have they talked about? I guess we can presume there's going to be a unification of some sort at WrestleMania. But uh, there, <laughs> it's okay, Mike. It's just 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 let it out. So, just let it out. So if we're unifying the titles, mm-hmm. we've already announced the brand extension. We did. Or, no, excuse me, a shakeup. Yes, a shakeup. There's yes. a shakeup post WrestleMania. Yes. The fuck is the point? I don't know. And and I, the, the, the title was combined and split so many times. I feel like we're losing importance of the titles. I mean, uh, you know, not to mention the fact that there is like 20 titles at this point in WWE as well. Like, I just, I. I don't even know uh, how Paso McZombie is saying. Well, at least that's one less match for WrestleMania. Like we want one less match for WrestleMania at this point. No, but it's Oscar deserves that match. Absolutely. That's somebody. Like, that's somebody not getting a WrestleMania moment. Or now, match. now this could all be reversed next week. Yes, it could. Like, like. Maybe they just wanted to get Charlotte another title ring, so she's at eight. So I don't know. What you're but... saying is this is what's going to happen between now and next week. Mm-hmm. We have one more week of SmackDown and Raw before. Oh, so there's plenty of time for shit to happen. Yeah, sure. I mean, well, maybe she'll get it thrown in and they'll make it a five way for the NXT title. No, but. Uh... The... This was the simplest booking that they had hmm. Becky Ronda mm-hmm. the simplest booking it's the winner of the Royal Rumble against the champion of her choosing mm-hmm. we've done this since 1993 the simplest GD booking that you can have there was already heat you didn't have to develop anything but there are so many wrenches in this storyline. It's a damn Home Depot. Yeah. Yeah. And, and maybe this is there. Like, we need to stretch this out over, uh, you know, eight, nine, ten weeks of television across across Sword. two shows. Sword. The Royal Rumble has not changed its time of year. WrestleMania has not changed its time of year. Mm-mm. Like, what you do is, you run, Becky wants Ronda at Mania. Okay. 
Ronda can still defend her title, and maybe, who knows, maybe Becky screws someone over to make sure she gets Ronda. We and then when Becky beats Ronda, you have a you have a challenger for the title. We haven't gone this complicated with uh, Brock Lesnar and uh, Seth Rollins. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Um, so I, yeah, it's, but it 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 has been announced. It is the main event. Hell, they've thrown everything at it by now. Uh, why not? Um, sorry, I had to go check because somebody said that the New Day is now facing Iron Sheik and Nikolai Volkov. Did you just say the New Day? The New Day. The New Day. The New Day. Yeah, they have new out, they have new ring attire. Yeah, the, (laughs) the New Day. The New Day. New Day. It's a New Day. Yes, it is. The New Day. The nude, the new day, the new day. Damn it, damn it. Yeah, like um, Garza saying in the chat room, Rollins and Brock haven't done shit since Royal Rumble. No, they haven't. Wait, who 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 is Rollins and Brock? Wait, yeah, why couldn't that be the plan for for Ronda and Becky, and then we you know build some of the undercard. And you know what? If you, all right, if you want to stretch it out, fine. You had a built-in storyline. Mm-hmm. Becky wasn't supposed to be in the Rumble. So you have two people who have claims to Becky's shot. Mm-hmm. You have Charlotte, which is first and foremost. And then you have motherfucking Lana. Mainstream Matt is uh, on mic now with us. Uh, let's see. He is uh, checking his notes in his uh, very fancy leopard print uh, notebook over there. Did Dear you? Diary, <laughs> today Charlotte ruined wrestling. Dot, dot, dot. Again. Again. <laughs> <laughs> well, of all the people to ruin, at least it's Charlotte. Locked. Locked. <laughs> I'm, I'm done with Charlotte. <laughs> what do you think about the Oscar move tonight? <laughs> um, I, I, I'm so dumbfounded. I don't know where this is going. Do you think there's a chance that we're getting a four-way in the main event at WrestleMania? No! Come on! Come on. Nice round number. No. That's no. No? No. Well, we are going to get Joan Jett. Uh, I don't give out. a damn. Got to love booking those live bands for the heels, Sword. That's, That's right. That's right. I'm That's right. kind of excited about Joan Jett, to be I honest. Mean, it's kinda, it's I mean, Bobby typing in all like, caps. Vince McMahon and Charlotte. What about them? I don't are know. Are Vince they just a tag team? All caps. Bobby, we're gonna need context. Is, yeah, is we're that gonna what's need happening? context. I'm, I'm logging on. I'm logging on to to see what's going on on SmackDown right now and see if there's something else happening. Dear diary. Dear. <laughs> <laughs> um. Anyways, uh, a lot going on. Of course, uh, rolling into WrestleMania, including Kurt Angle seems to be having all the matches that we wish happened at WrestleMania. Not all of them. Not all of them. What? Not yet. Not yet. Well, I mean, we had AJ and him tonight, which you know wasn't an entire match. And uh, and uh, him and Samoa Joe apparently last night, right? Yep, yep. Not all of them. I'm sorry, I don't need to see TNA's greatest hits. It is. It is. It is TNA's greatest hits. I don't. Mm-hmm. I. There's one match. Like we got one of them that we needed. Mm-hmm. We got Gable. Mm-hmm. Daniel, motherfucking Brian. Mm-hmm. Needs yeah, to fight Kurt Angle. I don't know if we're gonna and get that one. Bobby has clarified: Vince McMahon and Charlotte ruined wrestling. Not just oh, okay, okay, okay. Fair enough. You know what's funny about when they have the when they're revisiting all the Kurt Angle TNA feuds is they always talk about you know these two have a long history. They never tell you where or how or somewhere when that happened, somewhere maybe I mean, it was Japan or something. Yeah, I don't know where it happened, but Kurt just told me he and Joe have wrestled a lot. I don't know where this happened, but apparently it was a thing. You can find out on Table for Three, though. You know, it was probably under the ring. With Hornswoggle. Like, I would love to see the wrestling matches that go on under that ring. This mystical other place this where all these fantastic place. matches you wish you would have seen happen. There, there aren't any matches under there. As far as I've been led to believe, it's just a thrilling legal drama. What? Under little the... People's Court. Oh, Little People's Court. That's right. Come on. That's Come right. on. Mm. Was that under the ring? Is that, that was under the that? ring. Like, our, could, buddy, could, our buddy Krista Joseph was in that segment. Contextually, that was under the ring. By the way, I love I love when I see a tweet from Krista Joseph during Raw last night 
Um, why are we having beat the clock challenges? <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Can we talk about that? Yeah, what happened? Explain to me what happened. Why? Why? Why, why did I we didn't watch Raw? Why did we? I, ha- I want to preface this. I did not watch. Raw. I, we have I a lot of opinions the for the show game. we didn't watch this week. I got home from the Pens game. I <laughs> All of that have been correct so saw, far, by the way. I saw the results from Raw, and I'm like, I don't want to make myself depressed. So I'm not going to watch it. And let's be clear. I'll have to watch it eventually. Yeah, let's be clear. You're going to watch it. You need to watch it like it's your job. Uh, So, I mean, it's going to happen. But in the meantime. I've never missed an episode of Raw. And damn it, that's not going to break me. Nope. But but the Beat the Clock Challenge. Let's let's break it down. as Break it down for me, Mike. First of all, it's fucking stupid. Mm Mm-hmm. It makes sense if you're going into, like, the Elimination Chamber or Royal Rumble or even uh, the hell something. You're determining what number one contender, maybe. Yes, a number one contender. Exactly. Something has to be on the line. Mm-hmm. Um, momentum is not something that can be transferred via pinning a Riot Squad member. Mm. Because guess what? They all have zero momentum. And some of them, I'm pretty sure, even have negative momentum. So, um, th- uh, they, all right, Alex is saying the only reason we had to beat the clock challenge is so they could point out a reason Charlotte shouldn't be in the match. Um, the reason Charlotte shouldn't be in the match is because she didn't win the Royal Rumble. <laughs> That's the reason. You don't need three two minute matches. To prove that, where it makes the Riot Squad look like even more dog shit than they already are. Right, right. Well, well, well like, ha- what happened to enhancement talent? Uh, there are things uh, like uh, pretty, it's the Riot Squad. It's the right, yeah, it's the Riot Squad for now. <laughs> it's sanity. No, we had enhancement talent. Like right. you just said, it's the one year anniversary of Lady Frost being on Raw. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Bring her back one year later. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that, that, that would be well well she they did have I mean, she was in a conga line last week they have two, enhancement talent they yeah. have female enhancement talent no absolutely absolutely even even just the lower card like nxt girls and stuff right <coughs> is me. this all because alicia fox isn't around anymore if the wage is she not uh did you not hear about alicia fox no what happened to alicia fox and and the reason Aaron anderson got fired oh that's related Oh boy, is it? I did. See, this is this is what happens when we talk too much indie stuff. Um, apparently, Alicia Fox showed up to a house show drunk. Okay, and Arn Anderson let her wrestle. Oh, yeah. Okay, because because I read I read the dirt sheet article about how Arn Anderson was let go because of how he handled a situation at a house show with no details. Because that's how we do news on the internet. Oh yeah, no, it's because Alicia was drunk and um, he let her wrestle. Jeez. Uh, but anyways, uh, sorry, losing my voice here. Did you? Could you imagine if some of the local talent didn't wrestle drunk? If they didn't? Yeah. Yeah, I can't imagine. <laughs> yeah, no, I can't imagine some of them <laughs> wrestling or refereeing sober. Um. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway. Yeah, and uh, Daniel Daniel Tiger saying in the chat, I'm raw. Next week is Riot Squad versus Ronda, Becky, and Charlotte. Yep. yep. Fucking why? Because. Anyways. Like, I, I hope Ruby Riot kicks them all in the fucking face and just pins all of them. Hey, if you, wanna, if you want to see wrestling that's probably not going to make you as angry as Mad Mike is right now, you can go check it out over at IndieWrestling.network, including our exclusive content like Uprise, just a, a new episode from uh, just a couple weeks ago filmed here this month. The newest talent uh, trying to get into Rise with a Y. That means a lot of dudes. Some girls, but a lot of dudes uh, <laughs> going on over there. Uh, and, of course, our friends at Prospect Pro Wrestling. If you haven't seen yet, you can go on our uh, IndieWrestling.us YouTube and Facebook and see the Pasta Death Match, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Pasta Death Match. Things you didn't know you, you could do with noodles in a... Uh, offensive manner. 
Offensive so, or offensive? Uh, yes. 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 <laughs> uh, so go check it out. It's uh, five ninety nine a month. Of course, you can get your seven day free trial and watch them that. And, and including uh, last week's uh, IWC eighteen, including the last match of DJZ. <laughs> now live over there, a great show. Another uh, another record breaking attendance for the Court Time Sports <laughs> Center for IWC. Go check it out, Indie Wrestling Dot Network, and you can get a lot of those titles on uh, VOD over at Indie Wrestling Dot US. And keep an eye out. We got in the editing bay now. Uh, Revenge Pro from this weekend up in Erie that uh, featured John McChesney, Wardlow, and uh, Bill Collier, and an, an, an AIW um, Absolute title, I believe it is. PB Smooth and Derek Direction being defended there, and the Remix title. Remix Riot title defended in a three-way TLC match with the hardest tables in pro wrestling. <laughs> oh, I am the table. <laughs> also, Angel Gate and uh, RWA coming up. Uh, RWA will be part of the network release here in the next week or so. So keep an eye out. New content coming all the time over there and a lot of great content from a lot of great promotions in the uh, in at least three states here over at Indie Wrestling Network. Here's my question about that Uprise clip that you just showed. Mm-hmm. The one guy had manic written across his butt in his T-shirt yeah, in the promo. Dude. That's that's one of the guys from Chaos Theory. Is that the dude? That's not the dude from the Denny's, was it? Oh, it might, no, no, no! I don't think it is. No, 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 no. That guy was a lot bigger. That's what I was like. This doesn't add up to me, but I, I just wanted to double check. No, I don't think so. <laughs> okay, because I know that guy's name was was he went by yeah, manic. Yeah, it was as well, like it was, was something like, manic too. I don't, I don't, I don't know if this guy's name. I mean, there's a lot of manics in pro wrestling. A lot of people like to be a manic. There's a Maria manic as well. I think it's just like it's like it's like it's like the Hart family probably. Anyways, uh, but they're not actually manic. related. Speaking of talent, congratulations to again uh, a friend of the show, uh, Lady Frost, debuted. Her first match in wrestling a year ago today. And we were there in Cleveland. I think, Missy, you were there with me, right? We were hanging with Billy Johnson. Yes. That was a thing that happened. Yes, because we were looking for her to come out, and they actually did a television spot with her. Like, the camera was in her face. Yes, yeah, so and we're like, hey, we know that person. Yes. So uh, she oh, was... Well, I remember she was the one that got the promo, right? Yeah, yeah. she got the promo. and, and I it, remember that now. And okay. it's, it's when they told her, do not look at the, at the camera. And when she went to walk away, she looked at the camera. And that's the picture that keeps getting circulated is her looking at the camera. Wait, hold on a second. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Hold on a second. Matt, Matt, you're making a lot of noise over there. Sorry. What are you doing? Preparing for Mayhem Mania. What, what are you, is that tape? Is it paper? What are you What are you doing it's over poster there? Board. It's poster board. Arts and crafts. Arts and crafts. <laughs> it's arts and crafts. Oh, <laughs> By the way, I don't okay. know if we, 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 we had a, a final look at, um, let's see, the live live shot of the Mayhem Mania board coming up here. How sweet. It is prepared. You see the super card distinction uh, over the uh, regular thing. We have the, the, a list of eliminators over there. I like how you put Enzo directly on the bottom. Yeah, oh. we'll see how long he stays there. We'll see how long. Oh, I'll tell you, I am, tell you what goes on with that. I'm really glad that Bob Backlund is not listed on the eliminators. Oh, wait, hey, 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 hey. You never know, the night is young. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll we'll see what's going on there. But anyways, congratulations, Sorry. Lady Frost. It, 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 was, it, it was kind of interesting because uh, she, she posted about it and how she kind of owns it uh, these days. But she got a lot of flack for that because that was her first match ever 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 and because she be was TV. chosen and she because she was chosen because uh, you know her twitter blew up after that i it really kind of gave her a head start on on you know kind of the next steps or the first steps of her wrestling career so much of being a professional wrestler from what i've heard is right place right time mm -hmm. so she has nothing to apologize for no absolutely well, at the time or now Li so Here's literally two of the biggest matches in wrestlemania happened because of right place right time with becky and kofi yeah, mm -hmm. literally those two matches would not exist without. And because, um, and this works too when talking about Becky and Kofi and Lady Frost being ready for that moment. She was ready. Mm -hmm. She went out there and did her thing, and you know, paid and, and and reaped the benefits. And the same thing applies to Becky and Kofi. Mm -hmm. Well, and she's had a lot of interesting opportunities arise too, because I know she did a, a show somewhere in Ohio that uh, Mick Foley was there and. Mm -hmm. Like she got to freeze McFoley, and McFoley, of course, froze. They had to carry him off to the backstage because he was frozen until she unfroze him. <laughs> and like little opportunities like that. Now, 
he's officiating her, their wedding. Yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> I'm like, that was probably the easiest bump Foley's ever taken. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> <That's> true. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't get to do. He doesn't have to do that stuff anymore. Yeah, he doesn't complain about the comedy spots anymore. No, 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 no. <laughs> but no, it's it's some really good stuff. And even uh, Alex Cars was talking about how uh, she debuted in Chikara last weekend for the Young Lions Cup. So, and I don't know. Did you see the uh, Violent Gentleman is uh, is is unofficially taking part in the um, the Dapper uh, contest? Uh, Quack and Rory Gulak and uh, I forget who the third member is uh, right now. The the suit. Hmm. Is it, competition. Is it I thought you said it was Quack and Bush. Yeah, it's, it's, it's Quack. It's Quack, Rory, Gulak, and a third guy. I can't remember. It's not. I can tell you, it's not a fit in. <laughs> it's not a fit. <laughs> Although a fit in in a suit would be freaking cool. <laughs> That's, let's let's just go ahead and do that. Please Garza, tell me. Make a fit in in a suit. <laughs> but it can't be. It can't be any suit. It has to be like a reptilian tie uh, scaled suit. Yes. Oh, snakeskin suit yes. with a fidian. That's amazing. Mm-hmm. Oh man. I'm still waiting for his uh his eventual match with Honey Badger. Um <laughs> uh, yeah, Alex is really looking forward to the Savage Gentleman uh popping up in Chikara. Th- th- those are char- they're, they're characters. They they, they, they kind of fit perfectly with that. Uh I was actually talking to to uh Victor this weekend about um, you know, being under the learning tree with Quack and there's a lot of good opportunities happening there, it sounds like. So, so it, it's it's ring announcer Mark Haggerty. Oh, thank you. Yes, thank you, Tina. That's that's uh, and Tina Alex. and Alex. Thanks, guys. Uh, so uh, really, good, really fun stuff happening over there. Sharp dressed snake says <laughs> Kyle <laughs> Turner. Um, Ooh, that's another show title option. That is another show title option. Somebody should be somebody. I should, really hope that you're keeping track of this. Keeping somebody going. should be producing the show so that we have these written down. I, I'll write it in I my diary. Know. You write it in your. <laughs> oh no, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Get that in your diary over there. It should. Our show title should just be "Dear Diary." Dear Diary. <laughs> Tonight was the best night ever. <laughs> and then Oscar wrestled Charlotte. All right. Oh. Meanwhile, I know we've been complaining about, uh, or the internet has been about Baron Corbin, but apparently John Cena has been trolling Baron Corbin on Twitter. I'm telling you, he's going to pop up. You think he's going to be happen. there? Rapidu, Rapidu, you can't Rap-a-doo, tell me. Rapidu, ruthless aggression. Tap, this, tap, tap. This is this is so weird because officially we have not seen a sign of the Undertaker or John Cena going into this WrestleMania. Are you are you prepared for that? Are you mentally like like feel like you're missing something out of this? Do you think? I mean, we also haven't seen signs of men's tag team titles being defended at WrestleMania either. So well, that that hasn't been for a while anyway. So well, this is. Do all you kind think of Undertaker is going to show up? Like, I mean, well, someone has to interrupt Elias because making a segue. I thought into... that was going to be The Rock. Right. <laughs> <laughs> later, I was on a secret, super secret assignment for some of our uh, Mayhem Mania stuff. Mm. And there are some interesting stats with regard mm. to who we've seen, where, and when. Mm-hmm. 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 Okay. Do we want to touch on that? Like, like, do we want to touch on that before the? I'll, before I'll we get into to tell it? you. Well, I mean, we're, I'm kind of saving this for a special occasion. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, because we got a lot on our plate tonight. But yes, um, the the research staff at at Sorgatron Media has been hard at work crunching what is now going to be. Five years of mayhem mania. Five years statistics, and we we are wow. crunching them. We are turning them into charts. We are we are we are collating them on spreadsheets like we're a Fortune 500 company, and we are looking for trends. And we're we're looking for um, uh yeah, yeah, uh, uh, yeah trends. We're looking we're looking for trends. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And, um, and uh, yeah, I think we'll um, I think we'll unwrap it. Maybe next week will be a good week to do it. That might be cl- that might out be. of the out of the fog. Yeah, no, that, that works. Yeah, that works great. That'll, that'll be that'll be good for the. But our research staff is Plus, good. Then we can have some recap from from this year because yeah, as I was going true. through some of that in- information, I'm like, oh, I wonder, I wonder what this year's stats look like. What do you think about like some of those names stats, from sure, years past? Oh like, my you goodness. see some of those names, you're like. Wow, that did happen. Yeah. <laughs> and then I'm back and I was like, I'm like, I let this happen? <laughs> I, I got into a situation just today where I had to explain Brains Strowman to my sister. Oh, yes, yes. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Brains Strowman? Brain Strowman, yes. Strowman. Brain Strowman, what, yeah. What was that That was about? a difficult thing because, you know, um, when when Braun was, was going through his, uh, I'm not going to tell you who my tag partner is with uh, with the bar, 
and the one we keep running out, Braun Strowman, pretending that he was oh, going to be his tag partner. Yeah. So we had to determine, because I think at the time, Braun Strowman was already booked on the Mayhem Mania card, whether <laughs> within WWE canon, if they really were two separate people, could they both be on the card at the same time? And I don't know, for some reason, moment of weakness, or, or Chad was hosting. I don't know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> and yet we couldn't do Kenny Omega for one week where he wasn't signed. I had to put my foot down. Well, that's right. We did let I Chad did. take over one week. Yeah. Yes. Don't you remember he was a better host than me? Yeah. Yeah. That's that's right. the, the crowd loved him. Crowd loved him because he let him do whatever they wanted. By the way, I want to apologize right now because I realized I did not post Talking Mayhem Mania from last week where you explained all the Patreon levels. <laughs> it was <laughs> a good episode, episode too. That was a good episode. Yeah. Uh, I'll put it up then everyone can watch it later and be like, oh. Oh, right. Well, I put them in written form on the uh, on the Wrestling Mayhem you Show com website. But as I've learned, no one reads the website. So <laughs> <laughs> we'll walk everybody through it. It'll be fun. You'll see. It'll be fine. Well, in, in, in that in that case, let's go ahead and get ready for that. But first, let's give a shout out to our good friends at Slice on Broadway, supporting Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh podcasting with the perfect pepperoni pizza for a good long time here here in the pittsburgh area if you're stopping by please go check them out here right up the street in beachview carnegie pa on the way out to the airport east end and over at pnc park home of the pittsburgh pirates uh you can check them out you you can follow them on instagram too you can definitely follow them on instagram as well there's a little bit they just followed you back that's great yeah (laughs) <laughs> and of course, the unofficial campaign to help them with their global expansion as they've uh, grown from one to four locations since being part of the show, Mayhem Bump. Uh, you please uh, take a picture of a Broadway in your town, wherever you may be across the continental United States, and uh, make sure to tag a PGH underscore slice on the Twitter or slice on Broadway on the Instagram and let them know you want a slice on your Broadway. They'll help them out so they know where the market is good. <laughs> Do some market research for them as well. And say, hi, I want to slay some of my Broadway. And I want your pizza in my face. All right. We will be <laughs> back after this with Mayhem Mania. Sidekick Media Services. We are your sidekick in business for social media, video production, and more. Find out more at SidekickMediaServices.com. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the time we've been waiting for all year for. <laughs> At least the last couple of months. Mm. It is Patreon in the bank. This is the time where you, the people that contribute on Patreon, patreon.com slash wrestling mayhem show, are, uh, get to um, it, throw your weight around, I guess. And uh, Mainstream Man. Hey. They, they said, no, that's not, that's not a shot at you, Bobby. Uh, it's, Mainstream Matt, what the Your hell is going diary. on? Your diary. Today I, okay, today I turned a whiteboard on its side. Okay, um, this is Mayhem Mania. Uh, we're trying to create the best WrestleMania card possible within the bounds of this current reality. Everyone out there knows how this game is played because you guys are all Patreon contributors. Um, I don't know what else to say. This is a very complicated situation. This is Patreon in the bank in which we invite only Patreon supporters of the Wrestling Mayhem show to play and make what will be the last round of moves here on Mayhem Mania, in which we try to create an eight-match super card. Right now, we have an eight-match undercard and two matches that have graduated the super card so far. So we need six more, and some of you will be granted awesome, incredible Infinity Gauntlet-like powers, um, the ability to just just make magic here on this board, and we're going to create matches and do all sorts of crazy stuff. I, I hardly know where to begin, so I'm going to start with the order of play. Okay, so we have um, <laughs> we have a dozen Patreons who oh, so are signed up Is for this. Is this the match. most? By far. Yeah. Making it rain. Jeez. Um, so anyway, um, the order of play will be um, first of all my wife, um, who will uh, have Missy as her proxy. Um, she will be going first. Uh, then we'll have Dave Podner. Then it will be. In one form or another, Heel Bradley. Um, then it will be Daniel Tiger, if that is your real name. Um, <laughs> Kyle Turner, then Doc Remedy, then Bobby F. J. Town, then Mad Mike, then Alex Cars, then Tina Keys, then Ed Burke. But I believe he has a proxy as well, Sorg. Yes, yes, and that, that, that is Ronnie Starks on the line as his proxy. Ronnie Starks yes. is going to be Ed Burke's proxy, and batting cleanup tonight will be the one. The only, my friend, your friend, our friend, 
our worst nightmare. <laughs> Bo <laughs> flipping <laughs> diggity. Woo! Woo! That's right. All right. Real quick. Here are the matches right now. Seth Rollins versus Jeff Hardy versus... This is the undercard, by the way. I can't find the type. I can't find the graphics. Don't worry. Just take the board. Just take the board. All right. All right. Here's the undercard. Seth Rollins versus Jeff Hardy versus Ricochet versus ACH versus Aleister Black, created by Nick Farah. AJ Styles versus Finn Balor, created by a mascot lion. Mia Yim versus Becky Lynch, created by Tina. <clears throat> Bianca Belair and Montez Ford versus Johnny Gargano and Candice LeRae versus Killian Dane and Nikki Cross versus Ray Rowe and Sarah Logan, created by Dave Potter. Walter, all caps, versus Samoa Joe, created by noted duck farmer Ty Cross. The Miz versus EC3, created by Brandon. Cesaro and Cassius Ono versus Kalisto and Lince Dorado versus Keith Lee and Dominic Dijakovic created by The Riz. Leo Rush versus Kofi Kingston versus Just Ali versus DJ Z created by what? I can't read my own hand. Sorgatron, you made that one. All right, your two graduated matches are Elias versus the Velveteen Dream created. I'm sorry, Elias versus Velveteen Dream. No article. Um, created by Sorgatron and. The Triconics, Zelina Vega, Billy Kay, Peyton Royce, BK Broiler, versus Tri Pirates, Asuka, Io Shirai, Kyrie Sane, credit by Bobby Ochi Town. Good job, Bobby. All right. Um, you'll see here, I have put the list of eliminators on the whiteboard this week. Why is this? Well, because as one of the awesome superpowers granted to um, a select few of you out there, there will be this week, and this is for those of you, um, actually the only ones of you, who will receive this awesome power will be Alex Cars and Mad Mike. But you have in your possession one un-eliminator, which can restore an eliminated wrestler back into the pool to be used in a match. The wrestlers who are currently on the eliminated list are Ric Flair, Jeff Jarrett, Brock Lesnar, Greg Maverick, John Cena, Randy Orton, Triple H, Charlotte, she ain't getting off of that, Bobby Fish, and Enzo Amore. I think we're in good shape. Oh, I wanted to do one more thing. Okay, so as part of this um, round, um, many of you will be receiving a chance to add stipulations to these matches. Um, also, as a, a special power, which will only be granted to Alex Cars and Mad Mike this week, they have one special eliminate a stipulation, etc., that they can use. And again, fellas, Alex and Mad Mike, you can use your uneliminator or your special eliminated stipulator, whatever we're calling it, you can use that at any time. So you can hold it just like a regular eliminator, pounce whatever you want, like a jungle cat, whatever you want to do. Um, and uh, we will uh, go from there. So uh, without further ado, Sorg, we're just going to jump into it. Because uh, right. I have, uh, well, I've lost my train of thought. Well, can you explain the uh, Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's just fun to say. I mean, okay, for the first time ever, We'll be holding the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble, first annual. Um, so every single one of you playing tonight will have to provide a surprise entrant into the first annual Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Uh, so uh, please be creative on that one. Um, well, let's just get into this, and I'm sure we'll um, be able to figure yeah, out what we're doing. As well. what? 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 I'm sorry. What's wait, that? Wait, what's that, Mad Mike? I want to use my Uneliminator. Mad Mike wants to use his Uneliminator. Mad Mike, go ahead. Um, because, because I want everyone to get, you know, equal opportunity at, uh, this person that's coming back onto the board, Mr. Rapidu himself, John Cena. Okay. He's back in the game. All right. Good job. John Cena, you're back in the game. I would also like to use my eliminator. Yes. Alex, go ahead. Because I believe he just deserves a spot on the card somewhere. What do you dare say, Enzo? I would like, I would like to uneliminate. Drake Maverick. All right. Okay. <laughs> wow, that was okay. one of the first, okay. wasn't he? He was might it? have been one of the first. Like one of the yeah, first. I think he was. <laughs> yeah. Be free, Drake Maverick. All right. Good times. All right. So now everyone, now no more excuses Eight for not five. having so many years. Okay. <laughs> um, all right. Now Missy's going to go first. Um, she is Jen's proxy, my wife. Um, Missy, first off, the first thing you have an option to do is to make a, uh, a standard move. Now, of course, we can 
switch one for one. We can take a match out entirely. We can bring an entirely new match in here. Uh, we can add another person or another team to a match. And do not forget the one time use only subtract option is still there to, uh, to remove a single person or tag team from a match. It's been out here for like goddamn seven weeks. No one's using it. So I don't know why. But um, maybe you guys like, you know, cluttered matches. You know, if that's your thing, then that's cool. But anyway, um, Missy, first of all, would you like to make a, uh, a standard move and perhaps create a match? I, I think that this is where I, I create this match. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, because uh, I have a piece of paper. Because you are working on um, that was, that was under hand. Jen's um, orders on, on this one. Yes. So she has the revival. We have to decide first which oh, match we we're going to get rid of. Which too. one are we yeah, getting rid of? Yeah. She didn't tell me that part. Well, Ooh. I think she's leaving it up to you. Okay. Which which one do I not want up there? Any help from the studio audience? Missy, get rid of one with a lot of people in it. I was looking at the Cesaro, Ono, Kalisto, Lince, Lee Dijakovic mess. No flips, just fists. Because I want to keep DJZ in there, so... <laughs> Yeah, I think I think we're getting rid of that one. Which one are we getting rid of? The Cesaro Ono Kalisto Lince. Okay. That would be the one. Let's get rid of that. All right, good job. <laughs> you throw and it what match the- are we going to create in its place? Okay, we are going to create the revival. Yes. And their competitors, the one, the only, Mojo Raleigh. Yes. And his tag team partner. Do it. Rob. Gronkowski. There it oh, is. No. Oh. Wait, you had that free written? <laughs> no. I knew what no, her move was. Yeah, no. it was the one that it was the one that he came with. Oh, <laughs> oh no. All right. Good work. Now, um, you may, um, Missy, this is all up to you at this point because I don't think Jen has sent any instructions on this one. But would you like to add a stipulation, a championship, a special referee, or something along those lines um, to one of the matches up here um, on either the undercard or the supercard? But I must remind you, as I remind everyone, the stipulations stick, okay? Once it's created, it's there forever. It's like a baby. Once you're born, you can't just put it back. It's there forever. An important lesson to remember. Yes, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Um, hmm. Mm, yes. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Sorry, I was totally not prepared for this one. Well, that's okay. You don't have to do it. Um... You can always leave that to somebody else. Do you have a, uh, someone you'd like to see in the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble? You must provide a surprise <laughs> entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. I said I was doing this earlier, and I'm totally doing this. Do it! Bob Backlund. Excellent! Put him in there. Write him down. Bob Backlund. Excellent. And we will not concern ourselves with your stipulation. Mr. President. Mr. President. You've done well. <laughs> All right, let's move on. Nothing Missy. but respect for my president. Great the job. The only Hall of Famer I'd want to see as president. <clears throat> All right, we're going to move on now, Sorg, to Dave Podner. Dave Podner of the Tiny Shutter Podcast. Dave you Podner. are up. And by the way, let, let's point out here, Dave Podner has decorated his uh, um, pop filter with uh, Mayhem Mania. It is pointing season, so it is. I need something to point to. It is. Dave, you are um, You're going to have a chance to make a standard move. Now, typically, you would also be able to swap a stipulation, but we don't have one on the board here yet. So Okay. I will ask you now if you want to make a standard okay. move. And I will remind you that the subtract option is still in play. Which I am going to use the subtract <gasps> option. Yes! Finally! Ooh! Damn it. Or shall I call it the delete option? Because I am removing Jeff Hardy. Yes. Let's do it. Okay, I'll go get him. There he goes. I'll get him. And that is removing Jeff Hardy from the match with Rollins, Ricochet, ACH, and Alistair Black? Yes. 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 All right. We are removing that right now. Dave Potter, would you like to add a stipulation to one of these matches? Yes. To the AJ versus Finn Balor match. <laughs> AJ versus Finn Balor match. The winner of the match. Oh God, the winner of the match. Gets custody of the Good Brothers. <laughs> oh, 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 oh wow. I like it. Oh wow. <laughs> Wait, is, is this a is this a good brothers on a forklift match? It most definitely is. No, yes. it's like with Dominic's um, <laughs> paper yes. briefcase. Oh. 
Oh, dude. Oh, well, that, that, is, that is well done. <laughs> there we go. That is well oh, done. Shit. Oh, I also, Wait, before doing? I forget, <laughs> this, <because laughs> why'd you throw paper them. at me? What? I just want to make sure we did have somewhere John Cena. John I'm Cena. I'm not going to add a stick. I don't want and to add the a stick. At least some were related. Like, I feel like this match is for all the Rivera jackets. <laughs> <laughs> All okay. right, we got it. We got it. It's going on the board. Right there. Okay. Custody Ponder, of the Good Brothers. Um, okay, Dave Potter, we need oh. you to uh, nominate, provide a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. I'm going to go, and this may be a little conventional, but I still think it would be entertaining. Uh, oh, let, let me Dune. let me throw. Oh, Pete Dune's great. Great. I want to mention also, um, entrance in the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble can be double booked. Oh, so good. Once, okay. if you put Pete Dune into the Mayhem Cluster Battle, Pete Dune can work another match. So I just want to let everybody okay. know that. Um, okay, this is where it gets good, Dave. Would you like to use your awesome godlike powers to auto graduate a match from the undercard to the super card? Well, actually, I'm I'm going to have a little abuse of powers on myself. What? You're going to exactly. abuse yourself? Exactly. By promoting my own match. Which one? The couples match. Yes. There you go. See that? You are so clever. All right. And now, Dave, exactly what I was gonna do. this is brilliant here. See, so we're, we've come up with a different reward system. This is going to get, this is where things get complicated. All right. <laughs> All right. Now, <laughs> Dave. Get complicated. Now, yeah, I know. Now, Dave. <laughs> yes. Work with me here, Dave. Okay. All right. Um, now we need to create a match to fill the hole on the undercard. Can you give me another match? Are we gonna have to go to the studio one? Now. Yeah. Right. It's getting right. ugly because yeah. I did not have time to think about that. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. I, I'm I'm ready for this. Mm. <laughs> I agree with Brandon that we should add Taco Fall to a match. Someone needs to do that. <laughs> I've already created Taco Dave. Fall on 2K19. Yeah. Book Liger. I did that on Sunday. <laughs> Liger needs yep. a match. Yeah. Retirement match. Mm. I don't know that much about him to put him to know. You know what? He wrestled Tyler Breeze once. Okay, true point. Yeah, true. No, no, you know what? I'm going to... I don't think we can let Liger It's a match that they're already pushing on NXT, and I'm going to use two people who were... Who Jen got rid of? Excellent. So I'm going to put Keith Lee mm -hmm. versus Dominic and I dive the coach. Dive the coach. Thank you. I got it. Did you get that spelling? No, I got that memorized. I've spelled it for about half of this damn mayhem mania. So we're in big <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right. Um, here's something else, Dave. As part yes. of your re reward for graduating your own match, you devious son of a bitch. Um, <laughs> that's part of the reward system. All right. Anytime someone's match gets graduated to the super card, since we can't really um, give them, you know, a punishment to hand out, mm -hmm. we're gonna let them not. We're gonna let them provide a, a surprise entrant to the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. So, Dave, you can provide yet another entrant Ooh. into the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble right now. <laughs> Ooh. Well, let me ask you. Just I, I want to, because this may mess up something else. I saw that there was a host possibility. Yes, correct? That, that's that's still to come. Yeah, Can you're, you're piling on. The host also be oh, in yeah. the cluster battle royale. Oh yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. Ah. Oh yeah. Who oh, yeah. else go guest? In that case, Michael Che. Nope. Nope. I'm gonna Joe bring. Jet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to put in someone who is undefeated in wrestling oh, with a 1 and 0 record. Oh, Mr. T. I know who this is. You probably do. You probably do. Someone who has a victory over the 205 general manager. Snooky? Drake no. Maverick? No, no. Kevin Federline? Oh god, my uh oh, god, my my brain just farted on me. Um how much a few bars? Uh, no, ooh, ooh, I know. No. Lord, Lord. No, it's not low. No, no. Um, it's not Lord Maxwell. 
Maxwell, yes. I'm sorry. Yes. I was going to say. King, uh, King, uh, King Maxwell. King Maxwell. Oh, no, King Maxwell. King Maxwell. Now, King Lord, Maxwell Lord, Lord the man Cluster Battle Rumble. King yes. Maxwell. King Maxwell. Yes. Is, is he the King host? Maxwell, yes. Is he your nominee for the host and as I well? I ruined my delivery, but. Uh, <laughs> Dave, is he also your nominee for the host of Mayhem Mania? No, I'm just like a couple years ago where we had the entire New Day as a host. I'm bringing in House Hardy. All of them? Ooh. All no, of them. Really I'm nice. talking. King Maxwell. I'm talking King Maxwell, Lord Wolfgang, Queen Rebecca. Right. Vanguard One. Vanguard One. It's <laughs> Weed. It's Lady weed. Vanguard <laughs> One. <laughs> That's right. I, I did have a girl. He does have a girlfriend now. And of yep. course, and of course, everyone's favorite, Senior Benjamin. And the scribe. Don't forget the scribe. Oh, yes. So it's, it's the whole uh, House Hardy gaggle, if you will. Excellent. Can I add my stipulation? Yes, you may. What you got? I want to add a special referee to our, our lovers match up there. Ooh. Oh, I, I can't wait. All right. <laughs> it's going to be Todd Christie. <laughs> Snitsky. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> what? Did you say Snitsky? Yes, I did. <laughs> So in other words, whatever couples break up. From Keep their in mind, yeah, it's, it's it wasn't his fault. fault. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> also, keep him away from King Maxwell. Exactly. <laughs> or field goal post. Hey, King Maxwell has more victories on pay per view than Snitsky does. I think. Um. All right. Dave Mania has moved to Taboo Tuesday. <laughs> Dave. <laughs> Dave, I must also inform you that because your match graduated at your own hand, you also get an eliminator. But I'm not going to rush you. We're going to move on to Bradley. But if you think of who you want to eliminate, please chime in. All right, Bradley? Or, I'm sorry. All right, Dave? Okay, no problem. All right, great. Um, all right. So here's the deal, Sorg. Um, Hill Bradley is not here. What are you looking at me like that for? Okay. What? Give me that look I'm again. interested in what's I'm happening. All right. I, 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 I'm going to need your help right with this me. One. I'm looking Hill deep Bradley. into your eyes Hill Bradley. ignoring that haircut. Yeah, he'll be. <laughs> he'll Bradley email or, or sent me his match. Yes. All right. But yes. he didn't tell me which match to get rid of. Um, he also just said, find someone to figure it out. So, Sorg, <laughs> okay. you figure out which match you want to get rid of. Get and rid I'm of? Write down which match wow. that I have to get Heel rid Bradley's of a match. going to replace it with Heel Bradley's oh, goddamn man. abomination. I'm of allowed a match. to get rid of any match you know, on here. Mayhem Mania was booked so clean until the powers of the McCoy I only want to get rid of one match. And Which I feel bad. And I feel bad if I get rid of the match that just went on there. What? Why would you put? Why would you do that? Why would I do that? Because I don't like that match. There. Well, that, now you've said it. All right. Well, we'll do that then. All right, uh, Mojo and Gronk. Goodbye. Thank you, Sorg. <laughs> Bradley's saying he's in the chat. <laughs> Bradley is in the chat. So if we- you need anything from him. We could ask him. Well, Bradley, which one would I you think like Bradley to Bradley overbooked this match here. Wait, hang on. Hang on. <laughs> wait, wait. wait, maybe he Sorry, didn't. I argue. think you're doing the role of the people on that one. Bradley, DM Sorg. Uh, Bradley says go ahead. Oh, okay. I think, okay, uh, I'm going to think... chime in right now with my eliminator. Uh-oh. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Who so is that, ahead. Potter? Do it. Gronk. Oh, no. I was hoping for Mojo. Oh, no. Oh, no. Or, or you could have very specifically just upset De- Jen Carlins and eliminated Dash Wilder. <laughs> that would have been a shitty thing to do. All right. <laughs> hey, hey Finn, Finn's still there. We Matt, still Matt have Carlins abs. has a we damn still have abs, All right. <laughs> All right. Bradley yeah, says Bradley, Bradley confirms that that is cool. the match he would have eliminated. Carlins. Are you ready to hear the match? Oh, I just looked All at right. chat. What Ouch. is, what is, yeah, Jen, Jen is yeah, not happy. Your, your wife Matt, is don't not go happy. Home. Matt, do Matt, don't go home. Do Matt, it. don't go home. <laughs> I'm just going straight to work. That's <laughs> good. That's good. All right. I all right. To check Twitter and see Someone's going to have to help me on whether the math me. works on this thing or not. All right. All right. Brad, Bradley's, Bradley's match is, that is a lot of writing on that card. Bradley sent me this match. Okay. It's son of a bitch. They don't call him heel Bradley for nothing. Uh-huh. The B team, uh huh, plus Zach Ryder and Kurt Hawkins, plus the Sing Brothers, oh, no. plus Sanity. I assume just the guys, plus <laughs> Apollo. 
versus oh my God. the Guardians of the Independence scene. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right. Oh, boy. <laughs> Are you telling me Chris LaRusso is now in Mayhem Mania? Ask Chris how he feels about that. Chris LaRusso. Chris LaRusso, are you still in the chat room, buddy? <laughs> Chris LaRusso oh, and Victor boy. Benjamin just made Mayhem Mania, as well as Ben Boone, a couple of referees. Uh, <laughs> that is 20-man eliminator. One, two, three, four. This is five, six, really going to upset seven, eight, nine, the stats yep. of Mayhem Mania for this year. Wow. Had another eliminator. All, all I'm going to say is that uh, Chris LaRusso can also win the tag team championship if Braun Strowman shows up with him. <laughs> the 10-year-old can win it. Chris LaRusso can, too. <laughs> and it's what? What is that? <laughs> Elimination tag, my uh, twenty my man was... elimination tag. So not only is it a bloated ten, twenty man tag, it's going to be elimination rule. So it's going to take about forty five minutes. Jeez. So we'll probably put that on the pre show. Um, <laughs> no, 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 no. We had a pre show with a forty five minute tag gauntlet one time. Uh, oh, I in Connellsville, that. that was so bad. Oh, so um, anyway, um, so Bradley, I must also <laughs> inform you that Garza um, says graphic designer Vito. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, it hasn't. It, the round isn't over yet, Garza. Has, I'm is, sorry. Is El Paso McZombie, don't panic. Is this a good time to mention that Chris LaRusso is uh, our guest next week here on this it's show? A great I think time. It's a great time to do that. <laughs> you could just use that picture. Um, Bradley, we, we did. If you want to jump into the chat room at any time, you are also um, granted the authority to not only name a surprise entrant into the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. But also nominate a host Whoa. for Mayhem Mania. So feel free to oh, jump in whenever which, you want to. Which one does people. that fall There's under? There's no one left. What? No, no. I, he I, has someone. He just listed somebody in the chat room. I'm oh, pro- did he? We need to clarify. Is that for the Battle Rumble? <laughs> yes. I think it's for both. I'm going to assume it's for both. Oh, well, you said you said Battle Rumble first, right? Yes, that's why I'm assuming. In that's... that case, uh, that person is Chest Flexor. Wait for the host or for the battle? Rumble? I think for the battle rumble. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, he just he, said he, he just listened to both, so he's both. Jeez. Oh, man. I feel like it should be the STDs as a whole for the. To be fair, if it's Chess Flexor versus King Maxel, I'm putting money on King Maxel. And he's saying for both. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy bastard. All I'm right, putting money on Maxel. <clears throat> Let's move on to um to Daniel. Where's Daniel, Daniel Tiger? Tiger? Daniel Tiger. Hold on, there he is. Now, now let's. We, we talked about this before the show. Who are you, Daniel? Daniel. Tiger? Daniel is. He he calls into the show often, and because of mm. the internet at his house, he is joining us from a local park, mm. so he can have cell reception. Daniel, it's this is real commitment. Board. Real commitment. That's how you keep the government. Away. Are you beside? <laughs> are you beside a soda machine? Is that what we've been hearing in the background? That's the sun drop machine here at the park. The what machine? Sun drop. Sundrop Sun machine. It's a local drink here in a uh, south. I'm familiar yeah, with Sundrop. Uh, where are it's you? It's delicious. I'm going to you right now. That's it. <laughs> there you oh, go. Wow. We, I'm sorry. Wait, wait does the Sundrop machine also have sheer wine in it? This is just for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I don't think so. All right. I think the only cherry we got is probably is cherry. Cherry Sundrop. <laughs> All right. Let's see where we got. All right, Daniel. Thanks. Um, wow, I love right. it. You wait, are. Wait, 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 I was like, wait, where are you hailing from? Where, yeah, where, where are, are you calling him from? I'm currently, I'm currently in Tennessee. Tennessee. Beautiful. Hey, I'll okay. be there in a couple weeks. Beautiful, oh, beautiful Tennessee. Listen, a man who doesn't have internet at his house and says he lives in a state. That's all you're getting. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else? Anything else? The tax man's coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, come actually, I, I'm the tax man and his. I live in Laura. Awesome. I live in Laura, Tennessee. Beautiful, beautiful. More of the Alabama State line. I love you guys, and I love this show. (laughs) All right, Daniel. Uh, Let's start off by uh, let's talk about. You can make a standard move uh, to the undercard, and I would also remind you that you are also, thanks to your generous contribution, you can also, if you choose to, instead of making one of those other standard moves, you can swap a stipulation uh, to another match. Although, if you move the twenty man elimination tag, I'm not sure how that would work. Uh, go, with, go with that. Um, maybe we should say that's an elimination tag. Anyway, Daniel, would you like to make a standard move to the undercard? I do, but I gotta have clarification first. Go ahead. Can I use Adam Rose? I think he retired, didn't he? He retired. Yeah. 
Do wrestlers actually ever well, retire? Well, no one really retires. Pretty recent, though. You know what? I think for the right amount of money, Adam Rose can be lured out of retirement. Go ahead. What do you got in mind? Okay. I'm going to take out The Miz versus EC3. All right. Whoa. How dare you? <gasps> Uh-oh. How dare First indeed? Feelings. Bam. <laughs> All right. Drake Maverick was going to be a and great I'm... Three for that match. Well, Don't listen to I the haters. I'm going to use my move and my stipulation at the same time. Yes. I'm going to have Adam, Adam Rose mm-hmm. versus No Way Jose. <laughs> <laughs> In a lumberjack match with the conga line and the rosebud right. around the ring. Oh wow! Yes. Wow. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No. No. So basically, you, all the rosebuds. Rose. Are you match, specifying? Sir. Are you specifying which rosebuds? Because if Braun Strowman is out there in his rosebud costume, <laughs> that'll be amazing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, I say everybody from the ind- in the independent scene. I was going to have Batista in the match as a triple threat, but someone put him in the one <clears> man tag. You know what I like about this year's Mayhem Mania? We're booking about 80 independent games. <laughs> yes. <That's right. laughs> It'll work. And, and just as an update, uh, Adam Rose announced his retirement on the 18th of this month. He'll be back. He, but we can get him. We can get it's, him I think it's realistic. Like I said, I mean, the, the right amount of money. Yeah. And he needs it. Um, Daniel, please Leo provide a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Oh, Garza, those look really nice. Okay. Um, I guess I'm gonna put. I'm gonna choose. I don't know if you can use them, but I guess I want to put. I'm gonna choose Glacier. Glacier. <laughs> yep. He we just, just saw uh, him wait, wrestle. Wait. Yeah, he just wrestled here. I we I filmed the match with him last month. So yes. Yes. Glacier. Absolutely. Yes. Glacier. I want Glacier. The All master right. of the cryonic kick. And now Daniel. I must uh, ask also, you now. Just real quick on Adam Rose. Uh, I know that we mentioned that Braun Strowman was a rosebud. Also, in the same uh, in the same clip of Braun Strowman being a rosebud was Becky Lynch and Simon Gotch. Yes. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, that, that, the rose those rose rosebuds were on the conga line. <laughs> they were elite. <laughs> 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 yes, they would. Um, I believe Elias was a part of that as well. Yes, he was. And Alexa Bliss. There, there were a lot Tucker. of Tucker. Wasn't Tucker in that too? Tucker and Otis. And Otis too. Was Otis was oh I didn't see Otis in that one, yeah. All right, Matt, what's up? Daniel, you can auto graduate a match from the undercard to the supercard. Which one do you wish, if any? Uh Mia Yim and versus Becky Lynch. Yes. Good job. There we go. Put that there. And finally, would you care to nominate a host for Mayhem Mania? Ooh. Off the top of my head, I can't think of anybody other than <laughs> Vicky Guerrero. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Bravo. Bravo. Who's typing? That's me. Sorry. Good job. All right. Daniel, thank you very much for calling in. Good thank moves. You. All right, let's bring in Kyle Turner. Kyle? Oh, I almost want to say this now, Sorg. Because Mia Yim and Becky Lynch has been uh, whatever. Oh, no, you know what? Wait. I forgot to do something. Bring Daniel back oh, in. Oh, Daniel, back in, back in. Bring yeah. him back. Bring him back. Daniel, there's a void on my undercard. Would you be able to create another match to fill that hole for me? Sure can. Uh, I want the... Usos and Roman Reigns. Oh my. Uh oh. Versus AOP and Baron Corbin. There it is. Whoa. Yes. Okay. Okay. I wouldn't mind seeing that match. That's the only time I'll accept Baron Corbin being on this card. <laughs> awesome. Daniel, thank you very much. I love the arts and crafts that go guys. into this. This is way too much, man. I was really hoping Larry would be here to like do all this for me, but. No. Oh, man. Oh, he had a laser tag. Yeah, he had he a laser to tag. No, he can just he can just laser tag with us tomorrow night. Um, by virtue of T- Mia Yim versus Becky Lynch graduating, Tina gets an eliminator that she can use at any time, oh, and um, she'll get to uh, nominate an extra surprise entrant for the uh, Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. 
Just <laughs> Jennifer in the chat. It hurts, doesn't it? <laughs> falling down. Okay. Um, who's next here? Kyle Turner. Kyle Turner. Kyle Turner is with us. Kyle Turner. I'm here. What's up, guys? Um, let's make a move to the uh, undercard if you care to. And I'll remind you that All right. you can uh, swap a stipulation if you want to. Go ahead. Uh, would Tommaso Ciampa still technically be available, or since he's injured, would he be taken out? No, he cannot be booked. He is uh, injured. He could be a okay. host, though, right? Hmm? He could be a host. He could be a host. <laughs> Goldie could be a host. Anyway, <laughs> the point is that all the um all the wrestlers come in their current physical condition. So yes, unfortunately, Tommaso, I would not let that man okay. wrestle a match right now. He yeah, could probably do I, it though. He was uh, going to be one of the names I used in uh, the match I had in mind. I'm sorry. Uh, I think to start off, I think we're going to take out the uh, 20 man match because there's too many people in there to remember who all was actually in. Um, Antonio Garza is praising you. I'm sure he will be in the chat room. He'll be praising you very shortly. It's gone. <laughs> it's gone. Well, I also said, I also said beforehand that uh, I was going to be a little bit of a bastard with his move, with my move, if I ever got a chance to. And since I do, uh, Matt Carlin's, I'm keeping. Uh, I'm going to do something that's going to make your wife very happy, and we are going to have Dean Ambrose. Taking on Pete Dunn. Nice. Nice. Because Ambrose, if it's his last time he deserves a match on there, what better way than to put him up against the Bruiserweight? Well, uh... Kyle, I'm glad you're doing something to make my wife happy because God knows. <laughs> <laughs> and by... Tell Passive McZombie has also uh, chimed in with his happiness. There are a lot Kyle of, Turner for a lot of emoticons in there. By the way, just, while we have a moment here, I just want to give a little preview to the chat room of the uh, the uh, graduated match graphics going up. There's a, a Ooh, they, they are, they Velvet are nice. Dream and Elias, and I think we have another one here for the Triconics uh, versus the Tri Pirates. So there's a, there's a visual for you guys if you're with us on video. Of so course, these will be up on the social media here shortly after. The oh, show. those are nice. So yeah, those, yes. are nice. those are fancy. Kyle, um, fancy would you like guys. to add a stipulation to any of the matches here on the uh, Mayhem Mania board? I remind you that the stipulation stick. Now I'm leaving the elimination tag on there because, um, yeah, you, you know it's there. Um, <laughs> with an elimination actually, tag in a one-on-one -on -one match, well, well, you know what happens. Anyway, I think I will add a stipulation to my match that I that I just made. Yes, and make it a uh, no holds barred. All right, no holds barred elimination tag sir, between two people. <laughs> <laughs> and if I'm not mistaken, I can also auto graduate a match if I'm. Am I right? Oh, you're you are so correct. You are, you are so correct. Okay. Kyle. You are, you, I'm going to go ahead and you do read the, the email. And go ahead and auto graduate that match. You're auto graduate <laughs> that match. Auto graduate yes. your own match. Yes. Should I let him do that? Why would you let everybody else? Have you I let, let everyone yep. else do it? Yeah. Why wouldn't you? Yep. All right, over here he goes. Good. And I, I have a good match to replace it. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, to fill that spot now that it's open, yes, we would yes. do. Yes, Shayna Baszler. Oh God, wait, hang on. Versus uh, Sonya Deville. Yes, nice. Yes. I like that. Baszler versus Deville. I like it. Baszler versus Deville. Nice. Awesome. Kyle, did we get a um? No, we haven't gotten one yet. We need you to provide a surprise entrant for the first annual entrant. Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Well, I think if he can manage to. Uh, not talk as much as he does on NXT UK. Uh, I think we could have Johnny Saint shamble his old ass down there and get involved. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh my God. What, what was that name again? Johnny, Johnny, Johnny Saint. Saint. Johnny he Saint has to bring himself. That British boy with him, right? Oh, oh Sid Scala will definitely walk him down to ringside. <laughs> oh, man. This cluster battle row might be the best match we've ever made. <laughs> That just gave me an idea for an entry. Oh, you. eat your heart out, <laughs> Wrestle Kingdom Rumble. I think we got yeah, this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, we got it under control, man. Um, All right. Baszler and Deville has been All added. Right, Kyle's match graduated. So, Kyle, you get an eliminator, too. Uh, no rush <laughs> on that, though. Um, and uh, can you nominate a host for Mayhem Mania? Did we already get a host? 
No, we didn't get a host. Let's see, a host. I think we should give somebody that definitely would be able to connect with the crowd pretty well. Uh, It's somebody that hasn't been on WWE in a while, but I feel like the fans would know who he was just the minute he picked up the microphone and started talking. So let's make the host for WrestleMania be none other than Joey Styles. Okay. Oh, my God. I love it. Yes. All right, Kyle. I think you're good. All right. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Thanks, Kyle. All right. Who's next? Doc Remedy. Doc Remedy. Dr. Remedy to you. Duck Remedy. Duck Remedy. Duck Remedy. Quack, quack, guys. Quack, hey, quack, quack. How's it going, how's it sir? Going? By the way, one of the OGs, one of the original Mayhemers. Such an OG. The only person who's been on the show longer than me besides Sork. Yes. Um, right. How are you doing tonight, Dr. Remedy? I'm doing pretty good. How's good. everyone else doing? Oh, I'm doing just fine. Um, Would you care to make a um a change to our undercard here? I would. In fact, on? some... Somebody did me a favor, and because six people is way too much in a match. Yeah. So in this kicks, flips, and dives match, now that Matt Jeff Hardy has been eliminated, I think we need to add Adam Cole, Bay Bay. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. There right. 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 we go. There we go. He's on it. He's on it. <laughs> you got a stipulation, Doctor Remedy? Uh that I do not have. Okay, no. Actually, problem. let's do a for the uh the flippy match there created by Sorgatron. Losers have to shave their heads. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god. Wait, wait, all the losers? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, are we are yes, okay. all the losers? Only the one Alright, so right now are we <laughs> I was always assuming this is one fall to a finish on this four-way match. So yes. are we saying that this is now wait, DJ the one Z who gets is... pinned will lose his hair? Wait, wait, wait. No, DJ no, no, no. Z and Leo the are only, good. Only the winner gets to keep his hair. The other three, regardless of who oh. takes the pinfall, shave their head. <laughs> wow. Wow. So that's <laughs> Leo Rush, Kofi Kingston, Ali, and DJ Z. Forget Ali. And I believe two of those guys already pretty much have buzzed hair. So. Pretty much. Oh, that boy. is a, um, a wildly, wildly weighted oh, stipulation. Man. Oh, man. Jeez. Great. Great. Fantastic. <laughs> Doc, how about a, uh, a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble? Uh, huh. This you know list. what? He's back in the fold now. Hulk Hogan. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, I was going to say, but y'all feel bad. You didn't think David ordered your right? eliminators, didn't you? <laughs> all right. Fantastic. Um, <laughs> all right, Doc. <laughs> let's um, let's see if there's a match on here you wish to auto-graduate to the super card. Mm-hmm. No? Nothing? Mm-hmm. Uh, we'll auto graduate Styles and Balor. All right, all right. Sorg, we're gonna have to find Liddy. Oh, 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 yes, for custody of the Good Brothers. All right, hold on. I'll, I'll tweet the main main event guys uh, and let them know. We need to find Liddy because Liddy gets uh, Liddy gets an eliminate. Yeah. Well, who doesn't like cats? I'm pretty sure that's who Liddy would eliminate. Absolutely. This damn post-it note. <laughs> I should have sprung for the store brand, Sorg. I should have gotten the name brand. <laughs> now I'm paying the price. All right. All right, Doc. Man, that cluster bell rumble. Man, I tell you what. Um, oh, boy. Oh, Doc, we're going to need a match to fill the hole on the undercard. You got one more in you? Yep. Let's right. do the Revival versus War Raiders. Nice. Oh, they're nice. back. They're back. Can't keep those top guys <laughs> off the card. For very long. No flips, just fists. There's a lot of fists in that one. Mm-hmm. And, and a cartwheel. And finally, please nominate a host for Mayhem Mania. Can I can I tell you guys, a, I, I saw this today uh, from Brandon Stroud. Apparently he uh, was putting out that he was like, hey, why don't you just have the Revival go down to be on NXT TakeOver defending the Raw Tag Team titles? <laughs> and I was like, Oh, that would be way more fun. I would like to watch that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That would be good. Uh, 
Oh, host for Mayhem Mania, we'll say ah, just something easy. We'll go with Alexa Bliss. Okay. Okay. Nothing flashy, just I like Miss Bliss. Uh you you have Jen Carlin's eternal gratitude in the chat room, Dave. My new best friend, she says. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Doc Remedy. And let me just say, it is a pleasure to have Doc Remedy back on the Absolutely. show. Absolutely. What a treat. Always. Yes. Thank you very I much. I appreciate being here. Thanks for including me. Come back anytime. That damn post-it note <laughs> fell down again. Bobby! <laughs> is Bobby next? Yep. All right, Bobby of J-Town. You I are next, I sir. Bobby of J-Town. I thought you were yelling at me because of the post-it note. I got it. It's like, it's not, not my fault. I'm oh, like, he's putting a piece of tape on. It's all right. He's putting a piece of tape on the note. It's not going <laughs> to... Okay, so we're fine. Good. All right. Everyone enjoy um, my descent into madness. Bobby? <laughs> that was me tonight. Bobby, you yeah. may make a standard move to the undercard. What will that be? All right. I'm sorry to do this, but I got to take Adam Rose and Noah Jose off. Oh. I'm well, sorry. After right, we're going to leave the Lumberjacks. <laughs> it's still a Lumberjack. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to leave the Lumberjacks. Mm -hmm. um, question. Answer. RJ City, is he under contract with Impact? No, not to my awareness. Okay. So I'm going to make RJ City, <laughs> friend of the show, versus Joey Ryan. Free agent. Free He's agent. also a free agent. New free agent. Hmm. X. How does RJ City not have a Wikipedia page? I don't know. Because I just bought a shirt. Yes, I saw that. The performance anxiety shirt. That's, shirt. that's uh that's all of our shirts. In a lumberjack <laughs> match. This is nice. I like this one. So <laughs> RJ Bobby, I'm I'm gonna ask for a stipulation. We're just gonna point out the RJ City versus Joey Ryan match is a lumberjack match. Which includes the rosebuds in the conga line outside. The line. <laughs> which, which is there any other way? Is there is there, is there that any match. other match you wanted to have? Yeah. All right. Um, Totes and perps. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna add a stipulation to my graduated match. Oh yes, the um, Triconics versus Tri Pirates. Yes. I'm gonna make that a tornado tag team match. Ooh, right. Bobby. Oh. <laughs> well played. So there's Bobbert. lots of chaos. Well played, Bobber. That is that is that is lovely. Good, Bobby. Good, good, good. You're not good. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm See, well, I I'm told a, you. I'm, I'm going to toss up here. Organize. I'm, right. I'm very glad I, I Bobby, have to go later in the round. You may now provide a surprise entrant for the first annual Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> well, Bobby, before before you, um, Garza has a very poignant question in the chat room. Mm -hmm. Are the Lumberjacks now penises? <laughs> Okay, um, the, the, <laughs> you, know, you know what? We'll leave the rosebuds as is, but those conga line people have to be penises. <laughs> <laughs> or, or would it be peni? Respect to the rosebuds. <laughs> Nothing but respect. <laughs> would it be peni? Not peni, sure. yeah. Peni. It's like Mickey Mouse. If I guess. there's a WrestleMania where there's just like dancing penises coming down the aisle, that's just <laughs> the end of wrestling. You know, there's nothing else you can do. Hey, Randy Orton came out with a whole like. Yeah. Do I get the graduated match too? No. No, you do not. I'm sorry okay. to say. Um, that, hmm. um, no, I'm sorry. I, we have rules, Bob. But we love right, your match. Um, let's put, since I want him to win so badly, Kurt Hawkins in the cluster rumble. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Is that what Kurt Honestly, K he's got a good chance. A mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm, Bobby, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to lead you along. No. What? Bobby, thank you. You've done the show a great service. Okay, you're welcome. All right. Goodbye. What? All right. <laughs> Mad Mike. Oh, man. Oh, here we go. All right. Now we got, coming up here, back-to-back -back Sorg, we got Thanos and Galactus coming up here. Mad Mike mm -hmm. and Cars back-to-back. -back, so mm -hmm. These guys paid buku bucks. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. So, Mad Mike. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. How are you? Oh, I'm. I'm, I'm All right. You guys, you both used your uneliminator. Does mm -hmm. he have his infinity gauntlet? He's got his infinity gauntlet. Yeah, he's had it. I think he's ready. Um. All right, Mike. Let's um. Let's just start from the beginning. Do you want to make a uh, a standard move? A simple. You bet your ass, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Matt. 
that dear diary. Okay. The stars have aligned. Have they now? Yes. All right. Tell me. Tell me more. Okay. Um. So that match of Rollins, Ricochet, ACH, Black Cole. I love all those guys. That shit's gone. Whoa. But we were that working on it all around. Gone. All right. That shit's gone. Whoa. That match is gone. Um. In its place is a similar dream match of epic proportions. How many people do um, I know I'm leaving up room on this guy? Just two people. Okay. One on one. <laughs> one on one. I'm Matt, I'm not overly complicated. You have simple taste. Uh, yeah. Okay. I, and you know, this is just something I want to see now. Yeah. And this is WWE's fault for making me want to see this. Okay. So I'm prefacing it now. Okay. Vince McMahon versus... George Mizanin. <laughs> yep. It's Dad Wars. <laughs> the owner of the WWE versus the owner of multiple Mr. Hero sandwich shops for the strap. Uh, okay. You know what, Mike? I, I won't argue. They have been making us want this match. Um, you want to add a stipulation anywhere, Mike? <laughs> this is bad. I, I don't ask me. Yeah, uh, I, I, I get to graduate a match, right, Matt? Uh, yeah. I'm mean, let's do. I was gonna say let's do one thing at a time here. Let's do the stipulation okay, okay, here yeah. first. Um, oh yeah, don't worry. You're you're getting your you, you'll get your candy. Don't worry. Oh yeah. Well, what if he wants to add a stipulation to his match? He's gonna create to. Oh, like, you don't eat oh, no, dessert no, no, no. before the main no, course. No, Missy, Mike. Missy, um. Uh, Mr. Doc Remedy did me a great service because I get to switch stipulations. <laughs> oh. oh, and um, that 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 um baldness stipulation. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, that's switching from that four way match to the match I just created. <laughs> oh, jeez! Okay. All right, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna um be a stickler on the rules, but you're still gonna get okay. what you want. Because since the swap a step is basically covered underneath the standard move and you already made one, but that's okay. We'll just create a second. Only the winner keeps this hair stipulation for the uh, matchup here. Oh, all right. I, I thought I thought I could switch stipulations too. All right. No, that's okay. A, there's a lot of hair cutting happening. I, in this I'm trying to be uh, I'm trying to be more lenient because I know that there's a zillion rules. You okay. know there is a there is a hairstylist that sponsored the a hair versus hair match at Resolution in Cleveland. Where, where Mr. Mazzana would be from. So. <laughs> All right. maybe, maybe we can call her up. We'll, t- Mike, we'll ask Joe to call her up. Mike, let's take care of this right now. Yes. Would you provide us with a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble? <laughs> <laughs> also misses that. I, I've been thinking about this for for a good while. And uh, we're going to go Jushin Thunder Liger. Okay. Are we going to let Jushin Thunder Liger come in here when he's under... Oh, he wrestles, Contract he wrestles Japan. everywhere. He no. wrestles everywhere? Yeah. You know what? He's just wrestling Tyler We just Breeze. won't pay him. It's okay. We just won't pay him? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's retiring, damn it. We need him on a Mayhem Mania card before he retires. There's history, There's history at WWE. Yeah, they had him the one time. Yeah. Maybe, maybe, we should tweet, maybe we should tweet him and ask him. Dude, do something like this. Yeah. They, uh, Would you work WrestleMania? He's the only worst who have ever wrestled Mayhem both Mania Tyler yes. Breeze and Brian Pillman. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, I don't Mike, know if that's true. Mike, would you care to auto graduate a match from the undercard oh. to the supercard, or, or using your enhanced Infinity Gauntlet powers, would you like to instead demote a match from the supercard down to the undercard? Um, well, as much as I would actively kind of like to irritate Jen by demoting that Ambrose match, I'm not going to do that. You're a nice man. I know. Um, I, I want. I want you to get home safe tonight, Matt. So I'm just going to <laughs> auto graduate the match I made. The Miz versus Vince. Uh, Vin, Miz is not not the Miz. George Mizanin. I know. I got it. Treat him it. with respect. <laughs> yes, His I'm name. going to auto graduate that name. match. Right. Can we call him Grand Miz? <laughs> I guess he is now. So. El Padre del Miz. How about that? Papa Miz. Papa Miz Benjamin <laughs> Dad. Okay. All right. Um, Happy Daddy Miz. Happy Daddy. Uh, El right. Hijo del Monroe. Yeah. 
Mad Mike. We must now create a match to fill this hold on the hole on the undercard. All right, and um, Matt, you know how I said the stars aligned? I guess they did. Guess what match I'm creating? What? The match I wrote down in September. Which one? Ricochet versus Cesaro. Aha. Uh-huh. Rick O. <laughs> 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 that is the sound of his gauntlet, everybody on audio. Making it work. Has right. the cards gone? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Bobby. Thank you. <laughs> what happened to all the rosebuds? <laughs> Podcasts are a visual medium. They're all penises now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel too good, Mr. Flexor. <laughs> Um. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Mike gonna... snapped his fingers, and half of TNA went away. <laughs> no one knows why. <laughs> they all went to WWE. Um, uh, Mike, would you uh, yes. please nominate a host for Mayhem Mania? Um. Well, as you can see, this card is quite loaded with chaos. And I feel like there's only one person that can properly host this card and that is Dario Cueto Mm -hmm. Dario Cueto Dario with a D okay Mike you also have and I'm I'm pointing this out right now because of the man who's coming after you you also have (laughs) one special eliminator you can use to eliminate a stipulation or uh, or another type of just as it is with the regular eliminators you can't eliminate something that's already on the card but right you can eliminate a stipulation um, that perhaps you would not like to see someone mention later. Perhaps in a minute or if two. you're insinuating, and I said <laughs> this before, if you're insinuating that I am going to eliminate WLC, please don't. <laughs> the only thing I have left. Do I be a merciful God? <laughs> yeah. Um, no, I'm not going to eliminate. We all see. Okay. Oh, I will God. eliminate. Uh, you know what? I'll eliminate a Cole Myers glove match. <laughs> all right. I'll just scroll it on there. <laughs> just, just based on the fact that I'm essentially wearing the nerd version of a Cole Myers glove. <laughs> the, the, the watching uh, Matt wrangle all the post-it notes and push them aside and retape them. This is part of the fun, guys. That's what, mm-hmm. that's what, that's what the oh, yeah. <laughs> Garza wanted me to do it. All right. Uh, uh, I Mike, I think that's that. it. Be on your way. Uh, I think Matt Carlin's just had fun um, buying all the office um, Matt, Oh, you Matt, got a, you got a, that is not it. You've got a normal eliminator too. Yes, I do. Mm. My normal eliminator is going to be Conor McGregor. <laughs> <laughs> good, good call by you. <laughs> fuck that guy. <laughs> He's not, he said he retired from the the UFC, and now he's not allowed to be at Mayhem Mania. So bang up, exactly. bang up day for you, Connor. <laughs> All right. Hey, if oh, we're not allowing Enzo. We damn sure ain't allowing Connor. Yeah, they can they can fight at some indie show on the parking lot. All right, good job, <laughs> Mad Mike. I will uh, send you on your way. But um, I, I believe on behalf of the Sorgatron Media Empire, thank you very much, and I hope you found this a very rewarding uh, patron in the bank. I was able to. It, I wish I had kept the scraps of paper from that first week just to show that if I taped them together, I was able to make the match I initially wanted. Excellent. Good job, Mike. Hold on. Playing the long game. What's up, Bo Diggity? Do we, are we still going? Oh, that's right, because Alex still has to go. Oh, oh, yeah. We still have Alex. We still have Tina. And then, I believe we then we will have Bo Diggity. Well, we also have Ronnie Starks. Oh, we have Ronnie Starks, too. Shh. We got a long way to go. Yeah. Alex Cars, are you there? <laughs> this, this might be the rest of the show, or we're done. <laughs> oh, this is the rest of the show. This I is am. the rest of the show. I told you this is the rest of the show. Forever. It's just, the, trust the process, Sword. We're oh, almost there. We're almost there. We were looking so good. Was it this long last year? What? Was it? We have more patrons yeah, this year. Yeah, we do. We, we do. have this too is, many patrons. We've had 12 patrons. We and and a, they all showed up. This might be it's a two-parter. It's going to be Wednesday soon. This might This might be a two-parter next year. All right. That's what they say. About you know what? When WrestleMania mm-hmm. goes to two nights, then we'll go to two nights. All right. All right. All right. All right. Alex, what's up, man? 
Alex? All right. Sorry. I, I just needed a minute because. Uh, oh, Alex, Alex, I wasn't going to do you dirty like that. Oh, man. I wasn't going to do right. that. Alex, mm-hmm. if, if, if you were anyone else, literally anyone else, I would have done it. But. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, right. let's go through this one step at a time. Here. First of all, do you want to make a standard move? And I'll remind you that you also can swap a stipulation to another match if you wish to. All right. Um, first, okay. So, you know what? I I'll be right back. I I gotta take care of something. Sorry. Do my ad spot, please. Okay, I'll hold your spot. Um. Okay. So. Okay. Hey, so. so. Um. How you doing? Hi. Hi. How are you? How's it going? Let's recap where we are on the card. This yes. is a good chance to recap. Yes. The card. This is a good point. I will now point out to everybody. We have Thursday seven soon. matches on the super card. Mm-hmm. We've got Elias versus Velveteen Dream. We've got the Triconics versus the Tri Pirates in a tornado tag match. We've got Bianca and Mon- Montez and Mr. and Mrs. Wrestling and Killian Dane and Nikki Cross and Ray Rowe and Sarah Logan with special referee oh. Snitsky. We've Ray got been double booked. Where oh no, he has. Who has? We've Ray double Rowe. booked Ray Rowe. Oh, no. no. He was over there. Why didn't anybody scream? All right. I just oh, realized no. it. Uh, where's Doc Remedy? Is he still out there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's up? My bad. Doc Remedy. <laughs> um, yep. We got to find hmm. someone else to team with Hanson. Ah. <laughs> uh, hmm. Ah. What's another tag team? But, uh, you uh, just find another guy. I mean, we'll keep Hanson. Just find somebody else. Just, just. Find a, just find another Viking. Eric Young. Or something. Throw Eric Young in there. Eric Young. Set, no, yes. wait, 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 wait. I was going to say, pick another guy that chopped you that night. No, okay, we're okay. Okay, uh, we're good. Or, <laughs> none of them wrestle. Or, or, or sanity. No, I'll, I'll take Hanson and, Hanson and Eric Young. I don't worry. I mean, there's at least three that work for WWE now. I guess two are on the okay. card already. Yeah, there's an announcer. Okay. Yeah, Corey Graves. Corey Graves. <laughs> oh. Oops. <clears throat> okay. I bet he can still chop. Just as good. All right. Sorry about that, Doc. I completely lost my train. It's my very bad. difficult to keep track. Larry's not here. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Wasn't Sanity somewhere? No, they were in we, that we uh, match okay. with the uh, All right. 18 yeah, people. Yeah, they, they oh, got wow. taken out. Yeah, they got taken out. I had to double check that one, too. All right. Um, What else do we have here? All right. Mia Yim versus Becky Lynch. Oh, Alex said do my ad spot was what he was trying to say. <laughs> <laughs> um, Dean Ambrose versus Pete Dunne. No holds barred. Um, elimination tag if you want to add oh. some people to that one, but that's not going to happen. It's a 20 so. man elimination tag with two people. Well, I mean, Dean can make it work. I love it. Um, hair match Vince McMahon versus George Mazanin <laughs> and AJ Styles versus Finn Balor for the custody of the Good Brothers. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Mayhem Mania is shaping up amazingly this year, guys. Uh, we got, I got Eliminator still floating around out there, don't we? Uh, Kyle Turner still has an Eliminator out there somewhere. Tina still has an eliminator. Liddy has an eliminator. Um, but they haven't chimed in yet. Let's go through the undercard real quick. Ricochet versus Cesaro. The Revival versus now Hanson and Eric Young. That works. That's good. Um, the Usos and Roman Reigns versus the AOP and Baron Corbin. Keith Lee versus Dominic Dijakovic. Walter versus Samoa Joe. Uh, RJ City versus Joey Ryan in a Lumberjack match, which includes the Rosebuds and the Conga line. Sonia, or oh wait, no, yeah, Sonia Deville versus Shayna Baszler, and Leo Rush versus Kofi Kingston versus Ali versus DJZ. Only the winner keeps his hair. <laughs> and also, I hope I hope WWE makes him like grow his fro back. Let's take a look at how things are shaping up on the first annual Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. So far, our entrants are Bob Backlund, Pete Dunn, working working double tonight, double pay, King Maxwell. Chest Flexor, Glacier, Johnny Saint, Hulk Hogan. How, how much are you excited to see Johnny Saint versus Hulk Hogan facing <laughs> off in the middle of the ring? How's that going to go down? <laughs> Kurt Hawkins. See, this is the this is it. All right, here's it. Johnny, all right, everyone clears out. All right, Johnny Saint and Hulk Hogan lock eyes. All right, the crowd goes crazy. <sighs> all right, they face off and, and like walkers. Warrior Hogan style. All right, Johnny Saint and Hulk Hogan. Kurt Hawkins gets up behind him and is like, Kurt Hawkins, man. And then Johnny Saint and Hulk Hogan both eliminate Kurt Hawkins. 
That's how it goes down, no. right? Deuce and Thunder Liger comes in and eliminate Hulk Hogan and Johnny oh, Saint. Matt, what? I get an extra member in the Battle Royal, don't I? Because I graduated a match. Uh, yes, I believe you do. Oh man. Okay. I'm do you have an idea for someone else? Wait, I might have lost track of some of our other guys. Oh God, who do I want to throw in? Oh, oh Alex, is, Alex is back. By the way. Oh, Alex, are you there? <clears throat> Okay. Yeah, I'm here. Ready to rock? Yeah, I was okay. gonna say if, if if Mike has an idea of who he wants to add, I'll let him go real quick. And then no, I'll no, it's okay. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna, gonna save it. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. So the first thing I'm gonna do. Yes. I've been chomping at the bit. Right. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do is my standard move. Yes. Which means that I'm going to probably gonna feel some heat for this, but I'm oh, going geez. to drop Lee versus Dijakovic. <sighs> okay. I'm really sorry, but I'm I gotta do that. And for uh, what good reason do you have for doing this, Alex? Because there's already too much good stuff. <laughs> oh, no. Wow. So, I know. So you want to introduce some crap. For those of okay. you who are not familiar with Alex, we, need, booking, we need a popcorn mash. Booking philosophy. <laughs> All right, go ahead, Alex. <laughs> okay. So, in its place, I'm going to put where everybody and cool here. Okay. In this place, I'm going to put Drake Maverick. Yes. Versus Sack Rider. Okay. Okay. And then... That's it? Okay. okay so that's, that's what, Yeah, that's my standard move. Stip. And then Stip. Uh, I'm not going to put it on, on, on that match, just okay. to clarify. All right. I'm going to add, I'm going to add a step to Elias versus the Velveteen Dream. <laughs> Sorry, Sorg. No. <laughs> no, no be... You're just pissing off Garza because he's going to have to remake that really nice graphic. <laughs> And it's going to be WLC. Oh, son of a bitch! <laughs> yes! yes. Yeah. Did I not what? already have it written? What? <laughs> WLC You're 6. Gonna, we're t- so we're talking about Elias and the Dream with tiny ladders, tiny oh tables, and oh tiny chairs. chairs. Tiny, guitars. tiny guitars. Tiny guitars. Tiny purple Aren't spotlight. We can have ukuleles. Tiny everything. We can have ukuleles. <laughs> tiny Dream. Yes. Hi. <laughs> oh, God. No, I'm just... No, I'm just I just thought about Velveteen Dream doing the elbow drop off of the tiny ladder, but making it look like he's jumping off the building. <laughs> oh, actually, um, speaking of Velveteen Dream, oh, Hulk Hogan is that cluster battle royal, right? Yes. Guess yeah. what? So the fuck is Velveteen Dream. Yeah, put the Dream in there, too. Good idea. <laughs> That's my second guy. He's going to pull double duty. Excellent. Um, okay. Alex, you uh we also yeah. need at least uh we, we need a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble from you as well. Oh yeah. Um so since Johnny Saint got added, I figured <laughs> you can't have Johnny Saint uh without a man that is a, a more recent contemporary. Uh he is the he is the founder of Chikara and a get a oh. guest trainer. At the performance center, he is Mike Quackenbush. Yes, okay. Just, uh, okay. Battle Rumble. I like it. Wow, this Battle Rumble is coming oh, out. Man, this is coming out fire. Nicely. Yes, top okay. I need. I need about five minutes. I'm sorry, I got something going on. I'll be right back. All right, all right, all right. You got it, bro. Um, hey, while he's doing that, I think I know my Kyle eliminator. Also, okay, here we go. Kyle Turner is here with his eliminator. What you got, Kyle? Yep. Uh, we're gonna do we're gonna do one thing and go ahead and take out uh we're gonna take we're gonna take the ass out of this and take out Bobby Lashley. All right. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. That's a solid eliminator. Also, I'm just scared of seeing Snitsky trying to kick King Maxwell, <laughs> so somebody might want to <laughs> do something about that. <laughs> uh, we're working on it. All right. <laughs> it's a process. All right. Look, I'm gonna recap the eliminator since we're got a moment here. Um. <laughs> Rick Flair, Jeff Jarrett, Brock Lesnar, Rob Gronkowski, Conor McGregor, 
<laughs> Randy Orton, Triple H, Charlotte Flair. She ain't getting up there. Bobby Fish, Enzo Amore, Lashley, Lashley, and the Coal Miners Glove Match. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope someone adds a Taipei Penne match. <laughs> There's still time. Yeah. You know what I have to do with the pasta death match yet? All right. Yeah. Um, well, that's because I can I... only do so many things. I, Man, I, so many things I really should have contributed to my own Patreon. <laughs> 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 I don't know if it would let me. You know, now's a good time to remind everybody that um, are we going to have time to do Talking Mayhem Mania after we're done? I don't know. I don't know. I, you might Who have to go to work. Well, what time is it? Oh, it's damn. almost tomorrow. <laughs> it's well, almost we're, Wednesday. Well, we were cruising along. It has we got been to eighty-four Alex. years. <laughs> <laughs> we weren't really cruising along. There's so many stipulations. There's so many people so many... to do. I mean, all these Patreons. I can't help it. People love Sorgatron Media. They want to give their money to you, Sorgatron. No, no, no. Eight years later. They love later. Mayhem Mania. They don't love Mayhem Mania. They hate Mayhem Mania. How else do you explain all these matches up here? <laughs> they hate we're me. We're like the BWO. We're taking over. They like to watch me, me squirm. Mr. Man vs. George Vizana is going to be a five-star classic. <laughs> We've been here so long, I was clean-shaven when we started. <laughs> you know what? That's please, funny. Please, please don't say five stars when it, when it mentions when the hoagies are in the same match. Um, <laughs> Anything hoagie-related. You, you know, Larry was clean-shaven when we started me. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so we're going to have to check like how is his progress on his beard. Uh-huh. To see, have you seen him lately? I haven't seen him lately. We saw him earlier. He was today. here earlier today. How's his beard looking? It beardish. 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 Like most definitely beardish. a beard. <laughs> yes. He grew his mayhem mania beard. Yes. It looks good. Is it like a playoff beard? It's like it's like a mayhem mania beard. Excellent. Yeah, it was pretty awesome. Is Alex back yet? No, he's not back uh, yet. I don't know what's going on. What else is there left to do? Oh, he's, we got to get him uh, out of Matt, Matt, who are the who are the candidates we have for hosts so far? Good. Oh yeah 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 yeah. Okay, here's the hand, candidates for the hosts. Um, so far, we have um, House Hardy. That's right, all of them. Um, Chest Flexor, Vicky Guerrero, <laughs> Joey Styles, Alexa Bliss, and Dario Cueto. That is a nice <laughs> list. Mm-hmm. That oh, is a man. good choice. We're going to put it like up for a I kind of wish they could each host like a fifth. Yeah, <laughs> let, let's see how things go. Can, can we circle back to Alex? Can we circle back? I'd love to circle back to Alex. Okay. Where is he? I, I don't know where he's at, so if we can circle back to the rest oh, of the Oh, we can circle move, back to what him? I'm saying. I guess we'll have to. Who's next? Uh, Tina's up next. Tina is up next. Okay. Oh, Alex is back. Alex is back. <laughs> Alex just came back. Just kidding, I'm Tina. Sorry. Tina, you're on I'm deck. Sorry. The shot clock. Hashtag like timing. Three, two, one. Oh, there, I'm back. Okay. Alex, let's auto-graduate, let's auto-graduate a match. Yes, let's. Yes. Um, Alex, be my friend. I didn't eliminate the LC. Be my friend. Alex, we only, I want to remind you, this yeah, is an important right. decision. There is only one one slot left on the super card. And the rest friend, of the Alex. matches on the undercard will be fighting for a spot on the Mayhem Mania undercard pre-show. Okay? Right, right. All right. That so the next match you took is going to be the eighth and Cesaro final match onto the super card. And Ricochet. <laughs> Alex. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Let's go. All right. I'm going to auto graduate. <laughs> to make up for the fact that I did do Sorg's other match, I'm going to auto graduate the four way with the winner keeping their hair. You All know right. what? Fuck you, <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You know what? Sorg, that's that's it. Match. Next year, I'm eliminating WLC. First chance I get. First chance I get. Jeez. Only the winner. Can we have two hair matches on this main card? This is yep. awesome. Yep. We have two this hair the matches hairiest on the main card. Main re- no, mania, mania it's card. It's not the hairiest. That's the thing is it's getting it's rid of the, the hair. Well, least <laughs> hairy. <laughs> least hairy. Man. Hairy mania. Alex? Alex. Oh, boy. You, you must create a match to fill the void on the undercard. Okay. Match to fill the void. Um, fill the void. Oh, geez. And Sword gets a, a contestant in the Battle Royal. Mm-hmm. Right. Mayhem yeah. Mania. Now you get something. Hmm. I ponder. Alex, While you, you ponder, Sword, enemy today. because your match graduated, you must provide a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Sorgi? 
Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Uh, I can't use Chris Jericho. Nope. No. Um, let's do... No. Yes. Yeah, let's do the Hurricane. The Hurricane. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> By the way, the Hurricane <laughs> is going to be in Meadville taking on Wardlow for the IWC Heavyweight Championship next month. We'll stand back. Stand back. <laughs> oh, Sorg, you get an eliminator too. Any well you also uh, you want to I eliminate? get an eliminator. I get an eliminator. I've already eliminated Bobby Fish. <laughs> Which is really arbitrary. <laughs> no, nope. not from his nope. perspective. <laughs> no, it's not. Ooh, no, it's ooh. not. Who else is okay. angry? King, that is something for talking him. Let's maybe. see. Sammy Guevara is under contract somewhere else. I can't eliminate him. <laughs> <laughs> um let's see let's see um alex how's it going on that match no way jose is being oh, used I, wait was no way jose uh he's here somewhere idea from the match is baron corbin being used anywhere yep you're right there oh damn okay, it wait where's no way jose did we lose him no, no way jose was taken off yeah he was oh, taken oh off. he's gone mm, you know what no way he's no way no way. <laughs> no way will we have a no way, Jose. <laughs> He's encroached on this card one too many yeah, times. No, yeah, no, I'm tired of seeing Oh, it. fuck. I missed an opportunity to nominate a host. Did, no, you did. did you nominated Matt, a host. Matt, can I change mine? Did nope. we nominate a host? Your, Damn. your vote for Dario Cueto was final. No. Oh, I should have said Poppy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Musical oh, guest. Oh, God, oh, damn. No. Can I change my elimination to Poppy? Musical <laughs> <laughs> guest. Alex, what's Poppy. your match? Uh, okay. So, for the match, uh, I have an idea, but I need to confer with you, mainstream Matt. That's it. Can I book a cardboard cutout of Kenny Omega? No. <laughs> no. Wait, who's wrestling him? <laughs> Trash. Yeah, who's his opponent? All right. Wait, who's the opponent? Um, Kurt Hawkins. <laughs> I, <laughs> I wouldn't want to see that. Like Kodo Abushi versus the cardboard cutout. I'd want to watch that. So, okay. Well, <laughs> this is a tough one. All right, let me think. Okay, I am going to book. You know, you know what's great about WWE in in these time and day of, of, in this time of day hmm. is that now they're they're showing more of a spotlight. Oh, I thought you were going to say Vince McMahon. Stop. They're showing more of a spotlight on the indie scene by way of companies like Evolve. Mm -hmm. You know who recently wrestled at Evolve? Who? Against a WWE superstar? Who? The independent TV, or sorry, the independent wrestling.tv champion, Orange Cassidy. Mm. So, I'm going to book Orange Cassidy. Against <laughs> hmm. <laughs> please be Stokely Hathaway. <laughs> Stokely <laughs> versus Stokely Hathaway. Yes, <laughs> yes. yes! <laughs> Chuck, Ta- Chuck Taylor has made it onto the Mayhem Mania card. Sorry. By the way, Chuck Taylor has bought the name Stokely Hathaway. Uh, <laughs> So he won't be using well, WWE. Yeah, so, so yeah, apparently Stokely's is a uh, Court Moore in NXT now. So yeah, Orange Cassidy versus Court Moore. We'll figure it out in graphics. Court Moore? Oh, oh, forget it. Good job. <laughs> Good job, Alex. Be on your way. Now, why we could have had Stokely Hathaway versus Chuck Taylor, but like have the name. No, the no, graphic. Chuck Taylor signed. Is he oh, signed to New Japan? Uh, AEW, I think. Technically, yeah, he's an AEW. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, he's working for their t-shirt company um, with, with his best friend. Yes. Yeah, who did hey, Matt? Before before you let me go, I do believe I still get to uh, add a host. Yes, contender. you're right. I forgot. So, Mike, Mad Mike, this doesn't make up for it. <laughs> I'm still gonna try. So my 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 uh, my uh, candidate for host is Poppy. Excellent. Oh. Okay. Should have won I love it. All right, Alex, be on your way. Where's Tina? Where's Tina? Tina? We're still made a powerful enemy, Alex. Powerful enemy. Tina? I'm here. The good news is that it's still morning out in the West Coast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
It's almost nine o'clock. <laughs> almost nine o'clock in the morning on the oh, West yeah, Coast. There you go. <laughs> Tina, uh, is this the latest you've been uh, hanging out for us? <laughs> I think so. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry. We're gonna we're gonna keep it nice and quick here. Um, first of all, Tina, this is um. First, we have to make a standard move to the undercard, or you can swap any stipulation if you want to. Uh, oh, you, wait. no, you can't. You can only make a standard move. I must restrict your your movements here. Make a standard move to this one of these matches on this undercard here. Um, I am going to dig the dagger a little bit deeper. Oh, good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, no. I knew it. Ricochet versus Cesaro must go. Damn it. Whoa. What is this? Wow. Personal. That's personal. Jeez. Oh. That personal. Oh, man. I have so many enemies next year. <laughs> so many enemies. I can only imagine what you've got in mind. Um, Not really. It's not as impressive, but I'll go ahead and try it. Uh, We'll do Alpha Female, Jazzy Gabbert. Yes. Oh. Okay. Okay. You um, already, her. already my favorite match in the card. You could have just uh, added her to my match. That would have been great. <laughs> versus. I figured, since, I figured since this one's coming out of retirement, we'll do the alpha female versus the glamazon, Beth Phoenix. Right. Oh my gosh! Whoa! Whoa. Nice. <sighs> very good. Very take, good. Take my money now. <laughs> right. Tina, would you like to add a stipulation to uh, any of these matches? I will add a stipulation to my match. That's low key better than the main event of WrestleMania this year. So, <laughs> yep. Um, I will add a stipulation to the match I just made: knockout or submission only. Ooh. Okay. Oh, Whoa. Shit. <laughs> submission. And Tina, would you please provide a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble? Um, let's go ahead and continue the carnage that I've just created. Uh, we'll go ahead and add Bull Nakano to it. By the way, uh, Tina, oh Tina, uh, you, oh you, you, you sent your email in earlier. Can, can I share the match that you were going to make? Oh, yes. Go ahead. <laughs> she was originally going to add Jazzy Gabber to the Mia Yim Becky Lynch match. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Oh, boy. <laughs> excellent. Excellent. Tina, thank you very much. I'm sorry to hustle off, but we got business to take care of. Oh, uh, I also have an eliminator. Oh, you do have an eliminator. I'm sorry. Uh, this is very why we... controversial one, but I'll make it quick. The Undertaker. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> okay. He's too busy making that Star, star Kid money. Star Kid? Star <laughs> Cast? Mike, star you have to, you have to take cast? your poster down now. Oh shit! <laughs> All right, good job. Uh, Glad you're keeping track of stuff, Tina. Because it's such a it's nice question. All right, let's get Ronnie Starks in here. Ronnie, hold on a second. He is on the line. Is he still with Ronnie, us? Ronnie, are you with us? I'm with you guys. Right. Ronnie, make a standard move change to the uh, one of the matches on the undercard here. Uh, can I eliminate a match? You can remove one match from the undercard and replace it with a new match involving new people. I will do that. All right, I'm going to eliminate the revival tag match. What? <laughs> oh yeah. God damn it. <laughs> and uh, and since you guys really got me bent over a barrel here, you know, you guys have made a lot of ridiculous changes, and uh, I want to do something fun. And uh, since we're allowed to use indie guys on the show, I'm going to be a mark for myself. No. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, I give you guys uh, the new day without Kofi Kingston. Okay. Versus Dan Sandwich, Dustin Vane, MT Osha. And the stipulation is Ronnie Starks on a um, forklift holding uh, a box of um, studios and a pl- of uh, pancakes. <laughs> you got all that? <laughs> so it's like a brunch on a pole match. Brunch on a pole match. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just call brunch on a pole? No, it's way more fun to show it all out now. Studios and a pancake. Oh, boy. 
Who was the second stand sandwich and who? Dustin Vane. Dustin Vane. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, OSHA Inc. versus The New Day. <sighs> Ronnie. I was not planning on doing that at all, but I did it anyway because it's late. <laughs> <laughs> can I, you, uh... We do something stupid. No, I love, I love stupid. This is fantastic. Uh, can you please uh, provide a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble? Uh, absolutely. Eric, uh, Hunter, Hagen, the, uh, the air guitars. Oh, Boogenhagen. Oh, Boogenhagen. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> right, Missy's got, Missy doesn't know how to spell that. I forgot about Boogs. I don't even know how to say it, so it's okay. So Boogenhagen. I got it. So Boogenhagen. <laughs> Ronnie, thanks for uh, thanks for hanging out and playing, and uh, thanks for hey, yeah. playing earlier uh, this year too. You know when he comes up, it's going to be shortened. We moves. appreciate nice all the you. members of the uh, <laughs> independent scene who uh, who come in. They're good sports when they play Mayhem Mania. Oh, all right, so we're down to our last participant. <laughs> yeah, well, I'll see you at Laser Tag tomorrow night, Ronnie. <laughs> all right. Pew pew. Thanks. All right. <laughs> All right, Sorg, we've reached wait, our last. Wait. Throw a shout out to Rogue Laser Grounds. Our friends at Scare House are doing that out in Atna oh, yeah. if you're in the area. So, Did he give you a suggestion for a host? No, I'm sorry. Ed Burke was not at that level. Oh, okay. See how it was a stickler I am? It gets all yeah, that's I, right. I didn't know if that was a specific level or, right. or what. All so. right, we got, we got one more player. One cool. more. One last man. Bo Diggity? That's right. That's right. Now, Bo, this is going to be pretty simple for you. You gotta make a change to one of these matches here on this undercard. This is pretty simple because I have to fix things because that is what I do mm -hmm. as a person. Yeah. And I'm sorry, Bobby, but the RJ City match is out. Oh, oh, oh. Here's why. Why? What's the stipulation on the match? The lumberjack match. Lumberjack. It's man. a lumberjack match. And who are the lumberjacks? Penises. <laughs> That's correct. I'm, that is correct. I'm bringing, I'm, I'm bringing back the Adam Rose No Way Jose match. Nope, I'm adding no, nope, 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 nope. I nope. can't, Why? I can't Sword, forgive you for that. I eliminated Sword No Way Jose. Oh, see, <laughs> this is why. So now I got to go to my backup match. And one of these guys is super retired, so I might need Matt Carlins to give me a, uh, a little bit of a go, no go on this. Is he super retired just, or just Adam Rose retired? <laughs> he's been retired for quite some time. I feel like we could bring him back. He's still alive, very much alive. Is it Bart Gunn? It is not Bart Gunn. Uh, the match that I have here is Daniel Bryan versus Duke the Dumpster Drosy. I'm in. Oh, man. <laughs> Recycling of, match. The, the Planet's Champion versus the Landfill Filler. He literally hailed from Mount Trashmore. With the, yeah. all right. oh, my God. With the Rosebuds? Oh, yep. Yep. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Yeah, in a lumberjack oh, match because you, what happens when you try to throw someone out of the ring? No, no, no. The trash goes back in the ring. Can, That's how this can, works. It's a no I, littering I, match. I, it's I, like I, art. I have a question. <laughs> can the lumberjacks be attached by giant plastic six pack holders as penises? No. Um, no. no. Bo Diggity, you no, do man. have a stipulation you can add here. You can, this is stipulation. Can, can Daniel Bryan wear his Wyatt family get up? Um, <laughs> sure. Um, <laughs> there's one match I actually wanted to graduate. Was, uh, whoa, whoa, wait, 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 wait. We got, we got somebody. Um, somebody needs to check their connection there. Oh no, I just turned you guys down for a minute. Nobody moved. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, we got, some, got something somewhere. Please please mute your mic if you're not talking, if you're not Bo Diggity. <laughs> All right, Bo, Bo Diggity, I think we got your back. Did my mic just speed up again? No, uh, no, no I, I don't know what it was. It was some kind of weird interference somewhere amongst the 12 people in this it was chat. The <laughs> wondering what the fuck we're doing. Who knows? Right. I think it's that sun drop machine going with <laughs> 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 uh, sun drop machine, machine is trying is to gone, communicate bro. with us dude i want a sun drop now sun drop was wine. the shit it's delicious it's absolutely it is. delicious and if you mix it with cheer wine it's incredible <laughs> uh, all i'm saying is i've been to the south and i've been fat in the south before all right that's all i'm saying uh yep um i really i wanted to, to graduate the walter versus joe match uh but i'm going to uh 
I'm actually going to, to, to throw a stipulation on it. All right. Uh, and that is, it's a first blood match now. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Do you because, realize that, that could be a five-second match? All I'm saying is that these dudes are going to beat the daylights out of each other, and maybe let's add a little color to it. How about that? Jeez. Sounds good to me. Bo uh, diggity. So I, have. I got one more task for you to complete, and then What's I up? will... And then we will be done. I need you to provide a surprise entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. First annual Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Mm. And I basically can choose from all of wrestling history so long as they're alive, given the people who are on this list. <laughs> yeah, you may notice that there's a bit of latitude being given on this one. It's kind of like, it's it's like that year Iron Sheik won because he couldn't be eliminated. <laughs> yeah. Mm, hold on. Hold on. I, I, have to, I have to Google. Is he still alive? May Young. May Young's and son. Oh, no. <laughs> is he still alive? According to this, yes, he is. And I will add to the, uh, as a surprise entrant, mm -hmm. Harrisburg, Pennsylvania's own Adam Bomb. Yeah. Whoa! Wait, no, I caught a football very from much him alive. one time. <laughs> I caught Crush one footballs at a house show. Great. Adam Bomb's still very much alive. Bo Diggity, thank nope. you for, uh, yeah, thanks Adam for batting cleanup. According to the internet, he's still alive. He retired in 2003. Yeah. Huh. So... He's still alive. Yeah. The now, Berserker, the now, Berserker is he, makes... Is he dressed as Adam Bomb or is he dressed as Wrath? No, he is dressed as Adam fucking Bomb. <laughs> Goggles and everything. I'm sorry. I said Adam Bomb. I didn't say the Night Stalker, <laughs> well, Wrath, or Brian Clark. I said Adam fucking well, I'm Bomb. Well, just say it because we could have had an epic WCW rematch of Glacier versus that versus Wrath in there. Ooh. You know they'll come face-to-face -face during that. Uh, we'll right. get that cheap And then pump. all of us will go... Ah! But no one else under the age of 35 will. We need to, we need to get like a booking uh, committee the, together and just like piece together how that how this mayhem cluster battle well, rumble that's would like, play That's kind of like when they did the match with Glacier. They like they put the two trainees that were dead like maybe three when Glacier rest. No, maybe not even that. No, they might not have been alive when Glacier was a thing. <laughs> and they're tagging with him. Nice. All right. Sorg, we're done. <laughs> Good. You want me to go over this card again? Oh, oh my god! What did we quick. end up with? Here it is, the Mayhem Mania <laughs> Super Jeez. Card. We did it! We did it! We did it again! We did it again! I, I think this is clearly the main event: Elias versus Velveteen Dream. We all see, man. Absolutely. <laughs> Triconics versus Tri Pirates in a tornado <laughs> tag. Um, the four-way couples match. Special referee Snitsky. <laughs> Mia Yim versus <laughs> Becky Lynch. It's just a match. Uh, Dean Ambrose. Dean's farewell match! Pete Dunn, no holds barred. Um, also, um, elimination tag if you care to do it that way. <laughs> Leo Rush versus Kofi <laughs> Kingston versus Ali versus DAG. Only the winner keeps his hair. Vince McMahon versus George Mazanin in a, another hair match. Um, should we do those back to back or should we space them out? Like, how would you handle like I think hair? double ring at the same time. Double at the same time. Yes. And finally. Four games, hair matches. <laughs> 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 AJ Styles versus Very Finn Balor for the custody the of the Good Brothers. That's a great stipulation. Too sweet and, me. Uh, too sweet me, bro. Um, and on the undercard, and these uh, eight matches will be go. Uh, we will be uh, decide in a vote which one of these eight matches will make it to the Mayhem Mania pre-show. Jazzy Gabbard versus Beth Phoenix, KO or submission only. Xavier Woods and Big E versus Dan Sandwich and uh, what's his dude's first name? Dustin Vane. Vane. Dustin Vane. Destin. Uh, Destin, Destin Vane. Vane and a Ronnie Starks on a forklift with a box of bootios and a plate of pancakes. Run, <laughs> John, <laughs> <laughs> a bowl. The Usos and Roman Reigns versus AOP and Baron Corbin. Drake Maverick versus Zack Ryder. Walter versus Samoa Joe first blood match. Daniel Bryan versus Duke the Dumpster Drozzy. <laughs> Lumberjack match. The Rosebuds in the conga line of the Lumberjacks. Shayna Baszler versus Sonya Deville. And finally, Orange Cassidy versus not Stokely Hathaway. Somebody else's is not his real name anymore. Uh, what's his name now? Court something? Court something? Court Mall. Court Mall. M-A-L-L. -L. What? Court Mall? Court Mall? Like That's a terrible food name. Food Court. Court Moore. Mall Food Court is his court name. Court Moore? On his, on his uh, Twitter, he just has CM, so I wonder if he's just going to call himself CM. Punk? Punk. I, mm. CM yeah, Punk. I is that the joke? <laughs> is that a Court Bauer joke, or is that a CM Punk joke? What I don't know. Going they're going to they're gonna turn the CM Punk chance into Court Moore. Punk My God. Um, Can we uh, do... 
Dare I? No. There's. We learned a lot. Say goodnight, sir. We, good. um, we have something else that we need to recap. I learned Vince. Oh, hey, asshole. there's another thing that happened. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so much <laughs> happening. Uh, you know what? Every year I say, this year I'm going to make it simple. <laughs> keep it simple. <laughs> Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble, the first annual, and your participants will be Bob Backlund, Pete Dunn, King Maxwell, Chest Flexor, Glacier, Johnny Saint, Hulk Hogan, <laughs> Kurt Hawkins, Jushin Thunder Liga, Velveteen Dream, Mike Quackenbush, The Hurricane, Bull Nakano, Eric Bugenhagen, and Adam Bomb. God oh, damn, man. that thing has come together. I am so sorry, Garza. Have a That's great day, Garza. <laughs> oh my yeah, God. Yeah, that should be the main event. <laughs> Mainstream Matt, send us home. Um, let's go home, Sorg. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to say? <laughs> yeah, guys, thank wait, wait, you so much. Did, we, did you go? Did you go over the hosts by chance? We did and at how one point. That's going to be handled. Yeah, how is that going to be handled? <laughs> uh, we're going to do a vote. Okay. On the uh, Mayhem Show Facebook. So group. there will be polls going up on the on the there Wrestle Mayhem Show going Facebook. Up on the Facebook group, and uh, those will be happening between now and next week. And uh, by next uh, Tuesday, we should be ready to uh, reveal those winners. Uh, the host nominees are uh, House Hardy, Chest Flexor, Vicky Guerrero, Joey Styles, Alexa Bliss. Dario Quito and Poppy. <laughs> shit. I'll give you one guess who's winning that vote. Sorry. Oh, shit. Honestly, uh, I don't know. <laughs> have with the group we have. Have we shared some love to our sponsors? I think, like, yo, hey, love to our sponsors, of course, OccupyProWrestling.com, who is a big contributor here with Alex Cars on, uh, on the show, and he did, he did a lot. <laughs> uh, also, Thank you to uh, uh, shout out uh, since they're in here, uh, uh, the wrestling revolution.com providing the graphics here for mayhem mania, which are amazing. Uh, and just, just cause he's hanging here, tiny shutter podcast for, uh, for Dave Potter. I, I, don't, I don't think if there's any other pluggables out here uh, with everybody hanging out, but man, youtube.com slash pop. There's that too. Uh, thank you everybody for this craziness. I love that this exists and, <laughs> My God! Musical guest. And now it's Wednesday, and <laughs> it is Wednesday now. <laughs> Thank you, everybody in the chat room. This has been amazing. We will have something of a follow up next week with Chris Larusso, who is not on the card now. Uh, and uh, we'll see you guys next time. Oh, mayhem out! This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.